Welcome. Hello. Welcome to Pokemon. Exit game, return title screen. Let us find a nice brush. <laughs> oh, God, there's something on my tablet. Okay, hang on. Need to find a nice Is it brush. Porn? No. <laughs> no. I thought we found your secret stash. I'm afraid not, no. Alright, let's. Next uh, week, guys, we'll try again. Next week, you try again. And right. again, over and over. So again. let's take a look. So today, we're going to be looking at. Poco. Poco. Poco Man. <laughs> Pokemon. It's going to be beige edition. I hope I spelled that right. I think you did. Pokemon, Pokemon beige edition. B Pokemon? But what is Pokemon? Pokemon. We're, we're Pokemon. Pokemon is... Is the greatest superhero of our time. It's to stop <coughs> Nintendo from taking down this fan project. Pokemon beige and teal. <laughs> I was thinking about Pokemon beige and brown. Nah, they're too similar. Well, that's the point. Plus, then everyone would only buy brown. No, you're wrong. No. Everyone would buy beige. No. Because beige would have the better legendary. I. That's not. Yeah, but then you'd always everyone would be all like, "You fucking beige boy." That's right. We are the beige boys. Anyway. What are you uh, going to call the people who buy Pokemon Brown? So today we're we're looking at something. So we're going to actually start work on this. It looks like a smiley face. So what does? The little, uh, eh? little underlying thing. Yeah. Oh yeah, yeah. He's like, This is the promotional Pokemon. <laughs> you can find them in game if you enter the Konami code. Oh, we can do that. Backwards. Hang on, we can we can we can do a little. Little promo boy. Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's make him one of the Pokemon. Let's make him a like a like a legendary that is hard to find. <laughs> it's just beige. It's a version exclusive too. So it's beige edition. This one. This is the legendary. Oh, I've got caps lock on. There we go. You'll have like little ears, I think. Actually, oh pain. If I put them right at the top, <laughs> he's like, mm. he's mmm. What if he's got like big cheeks? This is the mascot. Or at least this is the intended mascot. He won't become the mascot. The fans will decide that. I don't think he'll be the mascot. He's just he's just a little wee Pokemon. Yeah, Pokemon. Pokemon. Pokemon? Where Poco come from? Bam, 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 bam. Uh. Ow. I'm gonna give him a little I horn. Slap myself in the head. He needs like little. He needs a little ears somewhere, but I don't know where to put him. Maybe down here. Maybe? I don't know. You're the artist. What if he's like a little lizard guy? Lizard boy. Yeah, I think the idea of having him be a lizard is good. And then he can have like... This is a, yeah, this is in Photoshop. This is, yep, this is all in Photoshop. Uh, yep, okay. Well, Speaking of legendaries, this box art is rubbish. <laughs> wow, we got a subscriber already. Why Thank did you. I get an emote because they subscribe? Thank you, Skinny Foundation. Wow, so people give you emotes if they subscribe? I don't think so. I got K-pop merch. Wow. They got All right, there's a fucking K-pop event happening, isn't there? What the f... And it's really cringe. Ugh. And like, every time I go on anyone's uh, Twitch thing, Twitter, we all like, What's up, K-pop kinnies? And I'm it's just... Ah! Ugh. Or no, they say K-pop stands. Oh, yeah. Because they're not fans, are they? No. It, it's really fucking cringy and I hate it. 
It's like, don't call me that ever again. Okay, it's why like, do you, you see the Dreamcast logo on his head? You just have a wee circle. I'm, and it's like I'm a really flashlight. <laughs> <laughs> He's flashless. He's a light type. There you go. You know, here we go. Here's, here's, here's a Pokemon. Here's a Pokemon. Here's the he's first bul- ever designed Pokemon. He's the light Bulbasaur. He's Bul... 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 Bulbas. Can you look up... Can you do something for me, Charlotte? While you, while you, can, you, can you be the guy who looks up... Um, can you just look up synonym for lizard? Or like uh, other names for lizard? Or types of lizard? Or any sort of lizard Sin- with a light? Or like any... So, is, is there any lizard with like a light source on their body or something? It should really be doing this. We should really be doing this the other way, but like, if somehow there's a lizard with like a light source on its body at all, that'd be really funny. There's a gecko. Is there? What's it called? Uh, no, I meant like gecko is the word. <laughs> oh, 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 okay. It's just one of the ones that popped up because for some reason it went to reptile. Oh, hang on. I forgot about the music. Reptile. Here we go. Yeah. Relaxing Pokemon um... music. Anyway, so that's our first Pokemon. 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 Anyway. If it is it a flashlight? Okay, give me <laughs> Pokemon. <laughs> um Light Zerd no. What about something like Fleshel? <laughs> I don't know. But that's flesh. Fleshel. That's disgusting. Maybe he's a flesh type. Who knows? Anyway. Yeah. So, the first thing I was going to talk to you about, there was going to be a thought type. There was going to be a simp type. And there was going to be, uh, what was it called? A creep type. And a feminine type. No, the thought is the feminine type. No. It's, it's like a cycle. There's simps for the thoughts, right? So the thought is super effective. Hang on. Thought, super effective against... Oh. Hang on. I, I need to write this better. Hang on. Let me show you. Let me show what I mean. This why is... not make why not make the thought one VTubers? <laughs> there we go. This <laughs> the th- VTuber type. There's thoughts, which are super effective against simps. Simps are super effective against creeps. And creeps are super effective against thoughts. <laughs> I feel like thoughts isn't the right word. <laughs> e thought? No, is that I don't think thought fits. It's like a different thing altogether. Yeah, I guess. Yeah. Well, anyway, that's just the thing. I just know I want creeps in there somewhere because creep would be dark type, oh, essentially. <laughs> They'd be the dark type. Yeah. So we've got. That would commonly in dark alleys. So we've got the creep type, and all I know for the creep type is that it's mainly based on like uh, <laughs> suspicious that. looking, suspicious. Trench coats. Poco men. We call them Poco men. Poco men. Poco men. Poco monster. Poco monster. They are Poco men. Poco men. Okay. So, I was thinking for the first creep type, what about my little guy? My cute little guy. I thought you were going to say my little pony. Mm, I wasn't going to say that. I was thinking, hey, to make things easy, I I created. I created this thing a wee while back. This wee guy. <laughs> oh no. Wouldn't it make sense Not if he him. was a little Pokemon? <laughs> would he be the mascot? No, no, he would be like maybe one of the starters. Okay, so it's, would the other guy be a starter too? The little flashlight? Flesh- no, oh no. god! He's a flashlight! No, he's not! <laughs> flashlight, flashlight! <laughs> That was a slip of the tongue, but it fits. He's a flashlight. <laughs> He's not. Okay. Flashlight. So, but first, I wanted to get I wanted to get a couple of things uh, ready. So I was gonna say like um, I was gonna write down a list of different sorts of ideas for gyms, elite four. That's just what automatically comes up. Um, Laura Mipsum. Yeah, something in something. I'm sick of that appearing every time I fucking try to use the text box. Uh, you can actually, you can change that. I just forgot how. Okay, uh, good. Cause it, it keeps popping up and then I accidentally like click somewhere else trying to get rid of it and then it opens another <laughs> fucking text box. Okay, so. So fucking annoying. 
So, Jims, but we gotta call them something else, but oh, for now we'll call them Jims. He's a flashlight for the other Pokemon's nose. Oh my god, why is the thing so... Where's the A thing? There it is. No, that's not what I want. Oh, I need... Oh my god, this is so ridiculous. Uh, I need... I need paragraph. There we go. Okay, I need paragraph styles, apparently. That's not what I need. Apparently paragraph styles isn't right. Glyphs? Why the fuck would I need glyphs? Hang on, I need to look what I'm looking He's for. He's gonna write some hieroglyphics. Uh, actions, 3D, adjustments, brush settings, brushes, channels, character. Maybe character? That's it, character. Okay. I need to change the thing to auto instead of 60. So, gyms, and we've got, um, Elite Four for lack of a better name. Okay? The Stupendous Four. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> the Stupendous Six. It's gonna be harder. <laughs> stupendous Seven. Instead of type-based gyms, will they be theme-based gyms? They will be. So, right... Wait. It should be the stupendous seven when you beat them. Baldi's voice is like, "Wow, wow. you beat all seven stupendous." That's so good. Seven. Oh my god, Baldi can be the fucking gym, the the professor. <laughs> now all you have to do is beat the champion while you still can. <laughs> and if you take too long getting there, you just hear. Oh my He's god. <laughs> professor Baldi. Listen, if we, if we actually do s end up selling this somehow, it Baldi would, can't be there. It would have to be like Baldo or something. <laughs> Baldo, he has to be like a, a negative his colors. <laughs> Follow I We lab. do need Bentley as someone. So we've got champion. We've got bad guy. I, I personally think Bentley should just be a gym leader because we don't know what we're doing so far. I think Ben. Hmm. What if Bentley's. Who's the rival? He's gonna make a big. I could make just Bentley the champion. Yeah, I. Did we already decide that? No, we were thinking of making oh, a bad wait, guy. Right. Who is the champion? A big Rose. Uh, he shouldn't be the champion. Yeah. He wouldn't make it. Rival Bear Grills, Jim's Elite Four. Okay, Elite Four. I think this would be fairly simple. So, champion would be Bentley. Bear Girl should be really fucking like good against you, but no one else. <laughs> yeah. You keep hearing he he's losing horribly throughout the story, but anytime you fight him, it's like super hard. Yeah, very very difficult. The hard the last Bear Girls fight is harder than the champion. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it could be like you beat the champion, and then he comes up. And he's like, I just beat all the elite four. What's that? You're the champion. All right, time to fight. <laughs> and then he fights you immediately. And there's like a no time to heal or anything. And there's like a ninth battle, and it's against Bear Grylls. Wouldn't it be funny? It'd be fucking great. And then when and you come you back, you if you lose against him and you come back, he's, he's the, the champion. champion. <laughs> <laughs> and everyone, if you lose from from then on out, everyone like in any interaction you have, they'll mock you for losing to him. Yeah. The thing is, you can you can save before every Elite Four member, but not him. So you gotta fight. That you gotta you fight Bentley. The champion. Yes, you gotta fight Bentley, and then you have to fight Big Girls immediately afterward. There's no saving. <laughs> That'd be funny. What's the name of the region? Oh, uh, it's based on New Zealand, so I guess we'll call it Old Zealand. <laughs> Old Zealandia. 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 We'll figure out something. Okay, gyms. Elite Four. So what we, we, well, I know I, I want Poppy to be there somewhere, right? Should Poppy not be one of the two uh, playable characters? Why are you saying there's going to be two playable characters? I ain't doing those sprites, bro. It's going to be one playable character. Don't be a pussy. Uh uh. Rob, it's a second sprite. <laughs> do you know how many extra sprites you need to do for one extra character? Not if you make him not very, not that very, just enough to make it oh seem either male or female. <laughs> well, I wanted to have Poppy as an actual here. character. I was thinking we create. I was thinking we create brand new characters for the for the first for the for the player character. Glimbido. Can dirt I want it, somewhere in the game. I want it to. Yeah, of course. I Yay. want it to feel like you were on this journey with all these radical soda characters. 
Uh, not you were just witnessing a story. I don't want it to be, you are Poppy, you are doing the, I want this to be, hey, you are here, it's, it's your time to shine, it's, this is, this is up to you to get fucked. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so, uh, I also want Petty Tata to be somewhere, but I think Petty Tata should be a gym leader. To be honest. I think rapping sorcer sorcerer. Everyone's gonna- you have to make a joke in the dialogue about, like, your character mistakes them for Poppy again. What's that? Like, oh, Petty Tata? No, when you encounter Petty Tata, your character will have to accidentally think they're Poppy. Oh, that's probably a good idea. Poppy, rapping sorcerer, who else did I say? Uh, oh, a gym could- Mr. Incredible Zynga. I need to make this smaller. You see the electric type? <laughs> He'll have some electric types, I'm sure. Anything with a lightning bolt on it. Anything He's that looks like it'll go bazinga. He's the tall type. Mr. Oh. <laughs> Creative. Uh... Oh, thank you for the... Wait, is that even coming up? I know the notifications are above the screen, but are they actually coming up? Tell me if they're actually coming up on the screen for you guys, because if they're not, I'll have to fix that. Uh, there's all the bits I have, but I want to say thank you all so much for all the laughs over the years. Your sonic reviews really make me laugh. Thank you very much, uh, Ro Rose, Rosalinda Rose. Two roses. But Shrek 2 is one of the Elite Four! The Shrek 2 on VHS? I was gonna have it. <laughs> I was gonna have that as, like, maybe, like, a key item in the game. Yeah, I think it makes sense if it's a key item. Yeah, it makes more sense as an item rather than a, uh, uh, key oh, item. Oh, hello there. Uh, Shrek 2 on VHS. Was Violet Demon the rival? Pardon? Who's the Do we know who oh. the rival is? is Bear Grylls. Bear Grylls is the rival. Oh, okay, yeah, right, I completely yeah. forgot. You're going on a journey with Bear Grylls. Um, <laughs> I was thinking, uh, the Violet Demon could either be an evil guy, or he could be one of the Elite Four. Why is this music playing? <laughs> it's sad music's going on from black and white. Uh, what I was thinking is that Violet Demon, even if he is one part of the evil guys, he could still be part of the Elite Four. Could he? Yeah, why not? I don't think that would make... You'd, uh, you'd have to make that make sense in the writing, because I'm pretty sure people wouldn't, wouldn't let him be part of the Elite Four. That's alright. He's doing it secretly. <sighs> Probably printed Knuckles as a secret boss. That's not a bad idea either. When you get to the Elite Four and you accuse me, he's like, no, that was Arlo. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> Arlo goes to jail. He frames him. Uh, I'm going to I'm gonna write a, a bunch of... Um, hang on. Oh, thanks, Cheesy Chopper. What was I thought it was already said, but they, they gave 100 bits. And they oh, said thank they you. Like I didn't see that. Me. Is it coming up on the screen? I can't tell. I can only see the chat. No one. No one's... Said that, so I'm guessing it is. Can you people see? It's oh, not. Said no. It's not coming up on the screen. It should be. I don't understand why it's not. Lump crap. Let me uh, let me try. Let me try grab the one from Heart Gold. Hang on. If I copy that and I paste it into this one, and I paste reference, then I remove that one. And it should come up now. Let me let me test it on Streamlabs. Okay, can we skip forward through this? This isn't relaxing. This is more like panic-inducing. No, it's more sad. Oh, um, alert box. Here we go. Let's test it with something. Test donation. There we go. That works. Does it? Yeah. Oh well. Okay. Uh, let's see, okay. Oh, right. Okay. Well, tell you what. Beepo the Wrestling Clan is Elite Four? I don't know if Beepo the Wrestling Clan has, like, a... I don't think they're, like... There might be a supporting cast, maybe. Yeah, I don't think they're quite that... Quite, quite that amazing. In I don't think they're intelligent. <laughs> Again, Clown Spunk. I will, I will put in Paul... Uh, not Paulie. Fucking, uh... Beepo, the wrestling clown, uh, Freddy from Forces. These are just extra characters which are, which I've got here. Um, who else we got? We got the robber. 
the robber. Just, just the robber. That's his name. Uh, Wait, what about the Sonic uh, Lost World uh, cop dude? Oh yeah, the cop, the policeman. Uh, who else do we have here? Quip. Oh yeah, Quip. That's a thing. Uh, the deep penetrators, the announcer guy. I don't think the announcer guy had a voice. Had a had a. Oh, Cold Dad. That's right. Shit, he needs to be a gym leader, definitely. He'd be ice types or whatever. Ice well, yeah, he'd have like cold Pokemon. Any Pokemon that <laughs> any Pokemon that look miserable as fuck. <laughs> <laughs> You're gonna have to make miserable Pokemon just for him. That's right. Rapping, rapping Broken. sorcerer is there. Rapping Broken legs, is there. tails. Broken legs, tails. Tails and Patrick kissing. Oh yeah. Tails and they need to be there somewhere. Are we just going through my videos one by one? Um, You're streaming a really weird thing on my end. What's that? Where like it's repeatedly zooming in and out, like you know how it shows the border on the outside or whatever. Uh, yeah. Like the the color, the text, all that shit. Whenever you move your way on, put your mouse on the project, like on the page. Yep, yeah, it is. Okay, now take now take it off. Okay, I don't know actually what it's calls you, but it keeps like going in and out, really, like only showing the thing you're working on, but then showing the border like over and over. Oh, okay, that's really strange. Yeah, and I can't fucking concentrate on this at all because the text also keeps. Yeah, I'll the just... text keeps shifting too. Look, I'll just stream you my screen. That would work a lot better because trying to like show both at once is going. <laughs> <laughs> it's like Photoshop is breathing. <laughs> all right. Okay, I fixed it. Yay. Okay. Okay. So let's take a look. Uh, Monica. Monica would be. Monica would be good or something. So you're a character, but you can't do that. Yeah, well, it, it depends whether or not we're actually going to sell this or not. We'll just, we'll just do this as the meantime. Screaming Werehog. Screaming, just constantly screaming Werehog. Well, the thing is, you have Sonic characters in it and Shrek. Can you sell that? No, no. Yeah, that's the thing. You wouldn't be able to. Robin Sherlock cameos will probably appear somewhere. We could I, do. I, Rob's gonna be fucking everywhere. We could do like, um. Oh yeah, literally just me. Can yeah, I? Yeah, you. Oh wait, you were gonna be Sherlock. You were gonna be a uh, gym leader. Oh yeah. Uh, am I? I'm gonna be a gym leader too, I guess. The real radical soda. The is that your name? <laughs> <laughs> the real radical. Soda. Uh, who else we got? We got Holly. All your dialogue, you just- I swear I'm real. <laughs> oh, the Holly hasn't made my- I'll, I'll make Holly a cameo. But she just- she could be one of the trainers in your gym. Yeah, there you go. Perfect. I'll stop you from getting to him! You bitch! Pulls out a knife. <laughs> <laughs> uh, the Ziddy's Lamb and Sand- oh yeah, we gotta do the Ziddy's- And the healing <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> wouldn't that wouldn't that put your Pokemon's health down? Pokemon are weird. Right? They'll eat anything. I think they really Depends will. Depends on the Pokemon. Man. All right. Do you have to switch the science from yellow to green? What? What do you mean? No, that's what. Good guy in gravity said. One of the attacks needs to be Dragon Slam. Good idea. Whoops, Dragon that's Lorem Ipsum again. Lorem Ipsum. I'll add another thing over here on the right for like some moves and things that we think of. Denny's Slam and Sandwich is an uh, attack. Moves. Alright, uh, Dragon Slam. How many Poco Men are you playing? Incredible. Incredible Blast. Probably like 150, I guess. That's a lot. Dude, I could, what, what I'm thinking is I don't make this game pixel based. I can make it um, like doodle based. Yeah, I'll make it doodle based. Like I'll actually draw everything. That would make things much easier. It would, I think. The animation should be like silly too. Like you can just be like step, step, step. It's not like a smooth animation. It's just one leg up, next, next slide. One leg under up. Oh yeah, that's what the original Pokemon does. But it would look funny since it's all drawing. What I'd like to do is find some more key characters in, um... 
Laura Mipson. The Victory Road is Grand Metropolis. Oh my god, that needs to be a thing. Grand Metropolis. This isn't Victory Road. This is just <laughs> extravagant city. Isn't isn't there a place called Grand Something though? An emerald? I don't know. Hang on, let me let me look this up. While well, you yeah, uh, take a break, I'm grabbing some noodles in the kitchen. I'll be back in like two seconds. Grand old Grand Festival, Grandpa Forest. What? Wait, my Pokemon Emerald. Ever Grand City. That's it. Ever Grand Metropolis. <laughs> nice. Uh. Okay. If if people keep saying Arlo, I swear to God, I've got. I've got, I've got the Violet Demon. He's right here. He's right here. He's not Arlo. He's the Violet Demon. All right. Uh, all right. We're, we're, we're trying to stay away from uh, characters from other games. We're trying to think of Radical Soda references here, guys. Just in case, you know, eventually I might want to... If I work, like, six years on this game, I want to be able to sell it, maybe. Earn some money for all my work. <laughs> Generic the fish. Great. Thank you. Generic the fish. Oh, which reminds me of swim through all the rings. I'm going to need someone to find someone to do music. It'll be ridiculous. Norman the worm and Spooky the spider. <laughs> I don't know if those guys deserve to be <laughs> <laughs> Let's take a look. Um, I've done Cold Dead. Yep, done Cold Dead. Uh, if I go, I don't know if I want to look through my old videos. Jesus Christ! Oh, Ghost Dog, of course, Ghost Dog. I think Ghost Dog could be a Pokemon, to be honest. That's that's a good, that's a good idea, me. It's a good idea if I just. Shove a couple of these downwards. Poco man. Ghost dog. You just base one around ghost dog. Uh, I'm I'm sure surely there's a bunch more stuff I'm sure we could do. Uh, I've been making videos for a long time. I'm sure there's there's a lot of the punishment room needs to be in this somewhere. <laughs> Am I doing custom locations like houses or places? Yeah, of course. Uh, of course, of course. I'm pretty sure it's not spelt that way. Do you really want us to go back and watch your old stuff? I mean, I could go back and watch my old stuff. You guys could watch with me if you want. I could put it on here if you want. But... I'm just looking, I'm basically just looking for more characters. I wonder if there's something really old. Like, the chicken. <laughs> That's fucking old. There's some really, really old videos here. You feel like Bowser should somehow be incorporated? Bowser? I mean, I could spell it the way I did on the thing, so it wouldn't be an issue, I guess. Wouldn't be an issue to put him in. Um, yeah, I could put Bowser. That's how that's spelt. What did I? What else did I even do? What? What am I? What are my even famous videos? I don't know. What are my famous videos? Do I have any famous videos apart from the Doki Doki one? a lot of stuff. It's a lot of stuff I've done. The music just stopped. Oh, there we go. Uh. I'm just take I'm just taking a look through some stuff here. Just take a look through some stuff. Surely there's some references, there's some there's some things that I remember. Maybe it'd be easier to start from the most recent ones. 
But then again, is it really a classic if it's from the most recent? <laughs> I just hover over the Minecraft video and I just see Homer and Selma. God damn it. <laughs> oh, that's ridiculous. That's actually ridiculous. I feel like, I feel like that should be banned. There's like, there's a lot of stuff, but I suppose there's a lot of like, a lot of versions of Poppy that look very, very different. I could add like the, the Zeddy girls into it somehow. I did, I did have all those Zeddy girls that I made that I never really used, apart from in some thumbnails. Scorprise, if you can't put in the deep penetrates, you can at least use the talking radio from that series. Yeah. Those are good, yeah. I'll put that in. Everything goes down. The radical soda guy from SpongeBob. It could be a reference to that, yeah. Uh, radical soda, SpongeBob. Reference. Tales with Broken Legs. Why does Tales with Broken Legs keep coming up? <laughs> what do you guys got with Tales and his Broken Legs? <laughs> Wasn't it only in one video as well? Frank? Wait, who the hell's Frank? I, d I don't remember Frank. From the Honey Bun videos? Greg, that three second. Oh my god, we'll make a Pokemon based on Greg. We gotta do it. It's working. We're getting somewhere. We've got two Pokemons already. Dark Souls 3 character as a Pokemon? Sure. We're gonna have to get characters here somewhere. I suppose we could make like ones based on different Poppy designs and different like. Oh my god, Poppy could be like the Eevee. Because she's got so many different designs, she could change it to a bunch of different shit. That'd be pretty cool. Uh, uh, uh Poppy... Poopy. <laughs> Poppy E-V-E. -E equivalent. The King the King guy from Trapped. Aw, oh, man, I love that guy. Furcon Studio... Oh my... The Gmon guy <laughs> from Half-Life? I just use the thing of, uh, oh, plops? Oh, plops. That'd be a great idea, actually. If I could just change it enough. The Where's My Mania review guy? <laughs> She's gonna do great city, put some respect in the mic. I guess we'll do The Chicken as, as, as a guy, as, as one. Balloon some call me Johnny. I could turn that into one. Balloon Johnny. Is he spelled no, it's John like that, right? I think so. What do you got? The red soda cup <laughs> from that one thing with the uh Coco Oh my I should do Coco with a rectangle head. Coco Rectangle head. She could she could be one of the thought types. Well, I'm not gonna call it thought, but you know. Oh, super form radical soda. Oh, that's a great idea. How would that that could maybe work in like the gym battle? When we're about to lose, I turn super and send out like my best Pokemon. Which is really silly, but also really powerful. Good idea. Oh, maybe I could be part of the Elite Four, but it's just my super form. <laughs> super rad. <laughs> Unless we come up with a better character. What else we got? Sonic Sender. Well, let's just Sonic of the XE. 
The Wisps is a forces gimmick. How about the Wisps is like the unknowns? They don't do shit. But they like, it's something stupid like, LEMON! And like you squeeze it to get lemon juice out of it. I guess I could do something like that. Wisp Pokemon, but not Wisps. Different. I'll, I'll write lemon and I'll, I'll that'll, that'll remind me of it. They're not even Pokemon. Why am I right Pokemon? It's it's very different. It's Poco, Poco Man. <laughs> A bottle of Seven Up. <laughs> Uh, that'll have to be a, an item. Maybe not 7-Up exactly, but... But, but something along those lines, yeah. A Big Thick? Oh, Big Thick needs to be a Pokemon. Definitely. The thickest Pokemon of all time. That sounds like a Pokemon, right? Big Thick? Numeral North instead of 7-Up. 7th... 7th Skyward. A Giga Thick? Big Thick evolves into Giga Thick. Good idea. Um... Let's see... Uh... What else we got? Oh yeah, I suppose I could do a reference to the characters in DDLC with, um, DDLC Poco Men. That actually could be a good idea. And then instead of having, like, an actual Monica thing, Monica-based Pokemon, whoops, Poco Man body pillow. <laughs> There you go, and there'll be like a, a one based on Monica, and it'll be like, uh... Reference from your favorite status list, it was on the paper of Beer Girls. It wasn't Heinz Beans, it was actually Waddy's Beans. Waddy's is a, uh... They could call it like Watt Bean, and it'd be like an electric type. <laughs> what a bean! What a bean! Would the intro to your game just be the Radical Soda intro? <laughs> oh. Porky from Back in Action. Creepig. <laughs> That's what that would... <laughs> oh, That's what that would look like. Tank Sonic. Oh, these are... Oh, Pasta Bake is a key item, of course. Of course, the Pasta Bake. They could be like the best item to heal with. That'd be great. Uh, it's a ro roller. It's like a roller coaster as a Pokemon. Oh god, I've got no idea how I would make a roller coaster into a Pokemon. How would I do that? <laughs> I'd have to give it wheels. I don't want to give a Pokemon wheels. How about a honey bun? That'd be great. Good idea. Uh, I need a. I need more room here. Uh, we're getting so so many ideas. Put Xavier in. Well, Xavier was somebody else's like thing. It wasn't. It wasn't my mod that I did that. It was. Somebody else's. I feel a bit weird putting it in. One of the cities is Radical City. Good idea. Radical City. So many good ideas here. So many good ideas. Uh, roller coaster is a move then? Yeah, that, that could be good. Coaster. Alright. I think we've got a good amount here to go on. 
If we can't think of any more, like, incredibly interesting characters I've done... I... I remember Dingadilly as a name, I can't remember what the hell Dingadilly was. Sonic Corgi? Oh yeah, Sonic Corgi as a Pokemon would be good. Sonic Corgi. There we go. I could have the Ziddy Girls as Pokemon. Yeah, that'd work. Actually, they don't need to be characters at all. They could just be an actual Pokemon. Chappy? I don't remember what Chappy is. Undertale is a move. <laughs> Um, demonetize symbol as a Pokemon. It's a good idea. Could also be a held item. The demonetize item. Or demonetize could be an ability. I think it could be an ability. I'll just write it down here. Demonetize. There could probably be a bunch of different things to do with demonetization. See, that's a key thing we forgot about. Demonetization. That's like a major part of the Radical Soda channel. Demonetize prevents them from attacking. I would say it probably just lowers their, like, attack. Or, de or randomly lowers a, a stat of the opposing Pokemon upon switching. That makes that make sense for me. Um, Spaghetti King? I'm the Spaghetti Ma I'm the Spaghetti King. That could work, that could work, that could work. Um, Spaghetti Kin, that's right, Spaghetti Kin. <laughs> this is my penguin, <laughs> Spaghetti Kin. Ah. Uh, Alright. So we're figuring something out. I'm nearly back. Sorry about this. Something came up. That's all right. Piss. Oh yeah, jar of apple apple juice. In quotation marks. There we go. <laughs> Beer girls hand you an apple juice. Apple juice in quotation marks. After each uh, battle with them, it restores <laughs> restores some of your. Pokemon's HP, but reduces their likeness towards you. Yeah. And we'll make dirt a Pokemon, I suppose. That, that would make sense. Hmm. Alright. I keep repeat. I keep repeating voice or speaking. I shouldn't be. Hang on. No, I shouldn't be. You have to make one of the benches say quarter. Good idea. Oh, I keep accidentally writing stuff. Oh, the Ricket Ralph creepy bastard. Good idea. Uh, Rick at Ralph dot exe. Guys, come up with all the good ones. The announcer guy from the Sonic Colors video. I'm not sure how I'd add that in, especially with no like uh, audio in the game. Unless it would be like a like an ability. Announcer, uh, it increases the power of sound type moves, maybe? I don't know. Sonic, help me! <laughs> it could be a move. <laughs> That's a sound type move right there. Sonic, help me! Oh my god, it's Minert T9! Wait, Minor T9. Or Minert 9. What do we want to say it? The man who made that long ass ghost dog game. You got any ideas, Minute Nine, for this for this game that I'm gonna be making now for you guys? 
Sonic help me is the protect move. <laughs> oh, it's it's not a bad idea. Sonic help me. It could be Sonic Corgi help me. Might have to be shorter than that though. Radical sex from your Sonic Mania video. What the f that sounds vaguely familiar, but I don't know what Radical Sex is from. It was Radical- it was a Radical Rex reference, right? Radical Sex? From the Sonic 1 video. Yeah, I, I think it was from the Sonic 1 video. It's, I, I, I'm thinking of... I'm in the final zone? When I say that? Listen, I don't think Beepo the Wrestling Clown is, should be a gym leader. You guys really think their video is so good? Oh, tips and tricks. Red Soda's tips and tricks. That's a that's a good reference. Tips and tricks. Sonic R tips and tricks. I remember that. I should add that into a new video. Labyrinth Zone song. Ugh. I don't know if I could do that. But I'll, I'll write Labyrinth in for you. Scooter would want to bust the nut. That's not even my reference. <laughs> How big am I thinking of this being? Big enough. I've made just long, like... Long games in my spare time for fucking Markiplier. If I added all three of them together, it'd make a decently long game. If I added in battles as well, like, I could make an extremely long game if I wanted. Start with the base, and then... You can make a boat the boner. Good idea. The boner. Ah. Oh. <laughs> ah. The computer guy from Halloween. Oh, you mean Liam? Ghosts and shit. He was always funny. Uh a game theories? That's a good idea. Ryan Griffith Smith. <laughs> oh. Wham stash with the addition of Markiplier. Mark base Pokemon. Because the fact that he's part of your, my history. I suppose he is. I woke up one day with 4,000 more subscribers just because he played my game. And I was like, holy shit. Jontron clone 37. <laughs> I suppose I could put in a wee reference to Mark 2. Uh, wham. Guiding Gravity was one of the subscribers. Wow! Now looking at those Markiplier fan games, I'm like, oh god, I did that so poorly. I could have done that so much more, like, strategically. And not look so desperate. It's pretty desperate, though. The Umber and Witch from the Bayonetta video? Yep. Oh no, it's an Umber and Witch! Uh, yeah, I think... That's a lot of... it's a lot of references. I don't know if I want to do the Dark Souls 3 character, that shit's ugly. <laughs> I hate that thing. The Green Hill references? We gotta talk about Green Hill at some point. Have Mr. Incredible Bazinga turn into the robber. <laughs> it's a it's a split evolution. You can choose to turn into Mr. Incredible Bazinga or the robber. <laughs> Green hell. <laughs> Not a bad idea. All right. Tell you what. 
Why don't we get started with trying to draw some Pokemon, eh? We need to think of some types, we need to think of some ideas, and we need to think of a, a way they all interact with one another. Probably be the best idea. So let's... Let's start with that. So... I'm gonna start writing stuff. And we're gonna see how this goes. So, we've got a couple of ideas. So we're gonna try to... We're gonna try keep them simple so I can put different sort of looking Pokemon in each one. So like, if I have Creep, for example. Creep can be a wide variety of things. Like, it can mean you look like a Creep. Means he could just be kind of creepy in general. Like, he could be looking kind of spooky. He could look evil. They could just have kind of dark looking colors. Kind of like the dark type in Pokemon. That's what I'm kind of going for. I don't want it to be like, if you see like, I don't know, um... If you see something like, I don't know, power, it means it means they, they always have to look really strong. Whereas with like fighting type, at least like you've got like multiple different types of fighting, multiple different. They've kind of like expanded out with types later on. But I think we'll try find some elements. We'll try find some funny ones and we'll see if we can uh, kind of get this. Screep, screepy. <laughs> Oh, like 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 the Screepies from Scalar. Oh my God! Yeah, 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 Yahoo! <laughs> Scalar. There needs to be a Scalar-based Pokemon. Scalar. <laughs> it's gotta be. And then there needs to be a yeah, 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 Yahoo reference somewhere. Maybe that'd be a move. Yeah, 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 yeah Yahoo needs to be a move. Yeah, 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 yeah. Who? <laughs> it's gotta be. It's gotta be right. There's so many, if we've just forgotten. Is it from Super Mario 64? No, it's from the Scalar, um... From the Scalar, uh, uh, review, uh not the review, the Scalar, Scalar live stream we did. It's in the first cutscene. Nice cock, bro. <laughs> Yeah, that should be some sort of stamp move. Uh, oh, G-Source. Oh, I forgot about G-Source. You know what it was called G-Source? It just so happened to rhyme with V-Source, but it was like Green Hill Source. <laughs> I shortened it to G-Source just because it sounded better. Oh, hold still, you devil. That's got to be a Pokemon. See, we haven't even been thinking about the streams. There's so many streams. There's so many different funny moments in those. Uh, wait, what was that? Am I going... Oh, shit, what the fuck? Did I just... I'm pressing Control-Z, but it's not working. Oh. Did I get rid of something? No! It's getting rid of them! Oh god! Why? Why is it doing this? A scaler? And then there's... What was there? Um... Uh, there was... There was commander. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Who is gone? Oh god. I can't redo. I was pressing control Z. Photoshop's got a real problem with that. Alright, well, that, that'll work. That'll work. Miguelo. Oh my god, there needs to be a Miguelo looking ass Pokemon. Control Y doesn't work on this one. Alright, so types. Uh, what about something like Fluff? What if we had, like, fluffy Pokemon? And it just so happened that they just happened to be fluffy. We know we want, like, a girl type. 
These are just names to go off with. Let's think. I'd like something to do with, like, um... I'd like some element ones to help with, like, the sexy type. Yeah, something like that. Agori eliminate Pete in some way. Oh my god! Eliminate Pete! Pete has to be, like, a... Like a, it's got to be like some sort of knockoff Pete for a gym, right? <laughs> and that <laughs> it just says eliminate Pete, and it's like a double battle. And there's like another Pete that you met before the gym, and it says eliminate Pete. The other Pete will help you. Put in Ghoulfield. <laughs> Ghoulfield was that really such a? That's actually a good idea. Like a ghost type cat. Ghoulfield. All right. Oh, should ghoul be one then? Like ghoul? It's kind of like ghost, but it's like... Maybe it should be ghoul instead of creep. That might work better. Can anyone think of anything better than like... How about femme? Like femme fatale? Because they are fighting after all. I think that would work. Femme type. That would work. I did put in Miguelo. Wait, did I miss Miguelo? Yeah, there he is. I'm back. Hello. Laugh, laugh, laugh and on. cry. <laughs> <laughs> laugh and cry. Oh, I spelled Stewie wrong. This is what we've come up with so far. Creep girl. Ghoul. Let's Let's look, look at Hero one full screen in there. Shit. Why is it such bad quality? I can't read your one, but I can read the stream one, but it only appears every five seconds. Oh, okay. Wait, you can't read that one? Oh, is yeah, it... the quality's super low. Hang on. It looks like moon. It looks like a bunch of missing nodes. What about that then? Hey, that works. All right, as long as my stream doesn't <laughs> turn to shite. I imagine it I'm even gonna make a Coco Rectangle Head Pokemon. Just for you. Rectangle? I don't want a rectangle head. <laughs> rectangle head Coco. Look, it'll look something like this. Like, it'll be like... That's like you like. Yeah, but... It's gonna be like... I think I have an image of rectangle head Coco somewhere. <laughs> she was like a creeper. <laughs> Did she explode? Something like that. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's gonna be good. It's gonna be great. So we've got Fem for the female looking ones. We've got Ghoul for like anything creepy looking. Anything dark. Uh we're just wondering if like uh so we need something like we just need other types now. So we've got this little flashlight guy here. How about something for electricity and things? Something to do with light. Flashlight. Like, how about glow? No, but we're, we're going to have glowy types for like specials, aren't we? I feel like glow we? is too... So, yeah. <coughs> how about just um, shiny then? Volt. No, I was thinking, make it less about electricity, more what? about light. Oh. Um... Although water isn't bad, because it could have some really good like jokes to do with it. What type is he? What type? What? Yes. Yes. What? What? Yes. What? What? Yes. <laughs> what type? What? Yes. Oh, that's what, I asked. what type? That's what I'm asking you. Yeah. What type? Yeah, I think what. <laughs> yeah. What? <laughs> oh, can we make it? Can we make it a thing to Osher what? And make it O. <laughs> yeah. What? What? The Noid. A glide type from the videos where you try to glide? That's actually a really good idea. That, instead of flying types, it's glide types. Yeah, it's a great idea. <laughs> glide type. It's really dumb. Now let me ask you, how many types are in Pokemon? I couldn't tell you. Well, let's think. There's grass. There's fire. There's water. There's rock. There's ground. 
There's cock type. Steel, there's dark, there's ghost, there is dragon, there's fairy, there's ice, there's, uh, shit, uh, there's, uh, uh, hang on. Dragon? Yeah, I, I you see. Already have dragon. I see. Dragon. Hang yeah. on, hang on. I've got this. I've got this. I've got this. There's, I see dark. Psychic. And bug. Psychic. Bug. And, and electric. And. And also, the easiest one poison. And normal. And. I, and. Uh, hang on. I've got this. Uh, this is normal. There's, there's uh, flying. And that's and? shit. Um, this is great. Uh, uh, are you messing with me now, or did I get them all? Fighting. Fighting, of course. Shit, I would never have remembered that. Fighting. <laughs> okay. All right. So that's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen. One, I'm not two, saying we need eighteen. Four, five. If we get rid of the ones that haven't, that were new, so that's fairy, dark, and steel. It's 15. So I well, think. Aren't dark types ghoul types? Yeah, pretty much. But they're not going to be exactly one for one. They're going to be kind of different. Um, I'm assuming ghoul is like a mix of the dark and ghosts and spooky. Mm -hmm. Is it like ghoul going to be like all that shit, like dark's ghost? Yeah, things like that, kind of, yeah. Yeah. Uh, let's see, what else we got? Um... Disappointing type. <laughs> Disappointing? <laughs> that your mother doesn't love you type. <laughs> your mom doesn't. YMD. Love How about one instead of, like, dragon? Because dragon is always for, like, cool-looking things. How about, like, epic or something? Something really silly. <laughs> loot box. The loot box? The loot box. The loot type. <laughs> uh, That'd be silly. Hang on. I want to do some like elemental types. I want to be able to draw something with leaves on its head. But what would I call that? I don't want to do nature. That's easy. Flora type. Flora. That's a good one, actually. Uh, what's uh, flora synonyms? Green type. Foliage. Green. Ooh. Greenery. Foliage Herbage. Herb type. You can put drugs in it. Veggie type. Moss oh type. my god! I can make them like out of vegetables and fruit. Be, but then, well, if you have veggie type, then it would only be vegetables. You you would lock yourself out. No, of you fruit. could do trees and stuff. Who cares? You'd lock. It. Excuse me. Verdure. Virgin type. No verdure. Leafage. Oh. Vegan type. Vegan Salad type. <laughs> Salad. <laughs> <laughs> I think salad's a good idea. I like salad type. Salad type, and it, you, see, I'd love it to be funny types. The salad type. Oh, also sexy salad. <gasps> and then that salad. could be sexy salad, salad and femme type together. The sexy salad sexy reference salad. from the Sonic something video. I can't remember what it was. I think I've seen that I like video thumbnail. I like, never watched it. I like vegan too, but I um. I always thought that video was a cooking video, but I just never looked at it. Wait, which one? The, 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 I think I like wasn't like the salad in one of your thumbnails or some shit. Oh no, no, that's Sonic Hacking Contest. Oh, I thought it was a. But that's video. not the one I'm talking about. <laughs> that's because it was and a I salad. Have no idea what everyone's talking about. That's because that was a a, a salad thing. Um... Space type? That's actually pretty cool. That's a good idea. Space. It could have things to do with like stars, black vacuum holes. Type. <laughs> I like that idea. A vacuum cleaner. We could call it could the. One of the could one of the space types just be a fucking vacuum cleaner because it's the vacuum of space? I would love to call that empty type. Just empty. Wait. As Every, in the space one are empty? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Empty. Because space is like empty for most of it. It's 99% empty. 99.9999% empty. Uh, but we also that could like... One. You could I also like make Pokemon that look really space. sad. And make them the empty type. Because they're empty inside. Oh. So would Sunai Cold be the empty gym? <laughs> He's empty inside because his son's what left him. It's just like... It's not even a gym. It's just like a warehouse which is like abandoned. It's empty. <laughs> 
But like <laughs> I like a, they were like a triple A meeting. I can imagine moves like void, something to do with voids and like things that suck. <laughs> yeah. Like vacuum pulse or something, or vacuum wave, things like that. Suck with two C's. But that would, that would be a fem move. Null space. There you go. Oh, no. Hang on. That would have to be the gym. You have to fight them in null space. Well, I was thinking null space could be either an ability or a move. Ooh, a move would actually be a lot better. You send them to null space. Yeah, it's like a two-turn they, move. It doesn't work if the enemy's uh, speed is high enough. Yeah! You, they, your speed has to be higher than theirs. <laughs> Oh, it could be a one-hit KO move, but your speed needs to be higher than them instead of your level needs to be higher than them. It w well, that would be overpowered now. No, 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 it would be like a 30% chance to hit. So it's a 30% chance, and it might never work. Yeah. No use it, but it'd be fucking hilarious. It would be. Sounds way too OP. Oh, no, they have that already in Pokemon. Well, third, they don't have it at 30%. They do, no, they do, it's actually. It's always 30%. It doesn't feel like it. Well, it is. I would lie to you. So someone said boost type. That's it's not a bad idea. There's a lot of boosting. I hate the boost type. But boost doesn't have to do with going fast. It could also do with like it's able to boost its teammates. It able it's able to boost things around it. So it'll be like a support class. I guess so. Mm. But we can't we can't be falling into too much of the. Um, I think it's a good idea. But I'll keep that one on. Keep that one. Uh, I I think. We should do some more elemental types now. So we've got one for like leafage. What about something that's hot? Hmm. Really <laughs> good. Uh, so it's hot. Spicy? That's a good idea. Steam type. I do like spicy type. I like spicy type. Spicy. We don't have cold, so I'm assuming there's like cold, we already have electric, which is what? Yeah, and also light has to do with what? Let, let me write down, oh, yeah. so it's like, girl, um, girl, 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 isn't that the fem type? Dark, oh wait, right, ghost, things like that. <laughs> you wrote down what? girl twice. Yeah, I know, light, because the only thing it needs to be girl, light and there also, be, uh, there could be effeminate males in there. Electric. Glide is to do with flying. Um, salad is to do with uh, 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 veggie, fruit, and also vegetation. Oh, that would work! A veggie would work for vegetation! You silly no, bitch. No, because no one would read it like that, Robin. You know that. You don't know that. Empty know has that. to do with like um, sound-based... Depression. Space... <laughs> Sadness. Sound, space and sad. Sound, space and the sadness. Three Boost. Uh, well, that kind of has to do with the opposite of empty, doesn't it? It can do with speed. It can do with uh, what is it? Support. Strength. Support. Strength. And it can also have to do with um. I, they have like a lot of moves that like like you remember how like with Blaziken saying oh you hit someone with a special move your speed increases mm. or like every time they do shit they just get stronger and stronger so you have to get them out of the way as fast as fucking possible let's just go upbeat so like they'd start off weak but then build up really, really quickly hot hot yep <laughs> that's about that's about it let's try icy I feel like for Femme you should like. Like, instead of just girl, girl, add, like, a feminist male. Because you'll, I imagine you'll eventually draw a girl and be like, mm, that kind of looks like a guy. And then it would fit in better. Nah. You're all gonna be girls. Alright, then. Let's play calling a femme, just call it girl, then. Ooh. What do you mean, femme? It's like femme fatale. Listen. I don't speak baguette, right? Alright. I don't know what femme fatale means. I'd rather not have something like a defender type. Because that would mean that every single Pokemon that's a defender type has to have high defense. Big boy type. A big boy. <laughs> and then big every boy. single Pokemon needs to be a big boy. 
I suppose it would well, be interesting. The big boy but... can be small that has like a big fucking power suit or something. <laughs> <laughs> like, they just. It's really like you can see this like really small little kid with a really big happy face. It's got this like mech of death. <laughs> uh, anyway, I was thinking of. It's got like an omega mech. I was thinking of some sort of freezing type or, or uh, ice type. Freezer. Hmm? Freezer type. Freezer? Oh, Freezer no, fr from Dragon Ball, you mean? <laughs> <Ugh>. <laughs> Stupid. Uh, How about just cold? Freezer. How about cold for the Sunai cold guy? Hmm, yeah. Cold? The sun type. <laughs> <laughs> These well, are my children. We've got spicy, cold, and we've got... Wait, we're missing water, aren't we? Uh, water what about liquid? Perfect. What about liquid? Because then it doesn't just have to be water. It could be things like, like Ditto could be a liquid type. Ditto's more of a slimy boy. Yeah, but like a liquid could be like a liquid is just Pokemon. a liquid is just a moving material that flows. I'm not a liquid. I'm not a liquid. I move. No, you're not. No, your blood is a liquid. <gasps> moist type. Moist type. I'm like moist means water. <laughs> You'll be moist if you're moist with water. You don't have to. I, if I fucking throw a fucking water balloon and fill that lemonade at you, you're gonna still be moist. It's gotta be sticky. Yeah, and moist. <laughs> yeah, but what? What's ninety nine percent of lemonade? I don't know, lemon. No, it's water. <laughs> okay, fine. What if I fucking? I don't know. But if you have, you. if you have liquid mercury, none of that's water. You can't be moist with mercury. The slushy type! Would slushy not be like a mix between cold and liquid? <laughs> there could be an ability called double boost that improves stats when a double battle on both Pokemon a boost type. See, I think the problem <laughs> is cold and liquid are too boring. <laughs> They're just simple or like, you just work with a liquid type. Well, I mean, it's too broad. Liquid is too broad. Too broad? Because you could fucking air you like, you know, like things that would fit in, let's say, if you made like an apple Pokemon, they'd fucking apple juice or some well, shit. Oh, it's a liquid type now. What I'm thinking of is like, if you had like, let's say, like a little lizard that could shoot like magma and it carries magma in its belly and it shoots like He's magma. He's not a liquid you, type. I would say it's a spicy liquid type. If I can spit, I spit, that's maybe a liquid type. So Squirtle isn't a water type then? <laughs> no, he shoots water. Yeah, and this guy shoots magma. His whole thing is based around water. Your uh, your being can be based around just I have liquids. Oh, is, is one of his moves pissing? Actually, it, it could be. Yeah, it's big roses in the game. Uh, the only one I the only one of these types I disagree with so far is liquid. I think that's stupid, and not in the funny way. I don't know, man. I don't agree with that. What? It, what is the... Liquid doesn't have to be water, it's an elemental state. That's what I was meaning. I just wanted to be different. A snake man out of liquid metal would be... Yeah, I know, difference. but liquid is literally the basic word for those kind of things. What would you call it, then, if something was made out of liquid? I don't know. What do you call a fucking liquid type? I think it sounds really cool. Liquid. Liquid. You're trying to make the word sound cool, <laughs> but no one's gonna read like. Gonna I don't have to make the word sound cool. The word is cool. It's really not. You okay. Learn that word in fucking science because it's boring. You're like, oh, that's a state of matter. Okay. I see. Cold. Uh. Uh. What's what's what else? Cold. Uh. Cold. Cold. Emo emotionally. Like you, Shallow. Excuse me. I am not cold emotionally. I am depressed. There's a difference. Well, I'll keep this one on the back burner. For liquid. If we think of something better, we'll. I hope it, it turns in. to steam. What are we? Li what am I listening to? What is this? Someone's mm -hmm. singing. From Black and White 2. Alright. What else do we need? How about something to do with, like, um... Something hard. 
solid. Yeah. I really like the idea of having a solid liquid and gas type. How about a fucking solid? They're all solids. <laughs> no, it's, it's... Well, that's like saying everyone's normal. Wait, would solid type be the normal type? Uh, so I, I would imagine solid is like anything that has solid is anything that has like like a like a like a like a tough exterior or is or is solid in some way whether it can create something tough or whether it is made of something tough or whether it looks tough i don't know i say put up to a vote because i i don't like the solid liquid gas idea i think it's dumb you're dumb but if i'm in the if i'm in the minority you can go ahead with it Plasma type instead of what would be pretty cool. Excuse me? That's what no, no, someone's no, saying. Yeah. Rob, Rob, we got to band together here and shut that person up. <laughs> what they just said is unholy. Well, Smimbo says they like solid liquid gas. All right, well, Smimbo, you know what? Fuck you. Hair type, please. <laughs> How dare you be mean to Smimbo? <laughs> yeah, even he's saying, whoa. Smimbo bullies me. <laughs> <laughs> maybe you... I don't know maybe everyone gets bullied nowadays yeah bouncy fairs on my side they're too general we are friends that's why we bully each other symbol so saying make solid liquid gas the starter types Coco's head is too fucking fat let's not start that now oh my god Coco could be a solid a solid something type I think solid liquid and gas are way a too solid boring. fim. Because her head's so rectangular, it's solid. <laughs> My see, head's... Do you see what I'm this getting at with shape? this? No, I really don't. For example. Because that doesn't make sense, here, Rob. Your here, head here. isn't square, it's still solid. Yeah, I know, but her head is rectangular. Do you get, do you get what I mean? Does this it make it... looks solid. If you sat on it, it looks like it would be solid. But if you sat on someone's head who was generally shaped like a regular person's head... Like... It would be just as solid. It doesn't look as solid. It looks like it could break if you give it a good punch. But it's, you know what's the difference? You know what the good thing about that is? You're not fucking punching him. You're sitting on him. Well, you would be punching Coco's head if she's in a battle with you. I think it's... I just think but it's, it's rock stupid. hard. I just think the names solid, liquid, and gas are stupid. Well, let me look up some synonyms then. That would be fine. Because they just sound way too boring. Like, oh, it's solid liquid and gas. When you have things like spicy, glide, cool, them, empty, I honestly, <laughs> boost. I honestly really like the, uh, really like the idea for liquid. Sounds really cool to me. The only one I don't like is gas, actually. I mean, maybe if one of them was liquid, but having all three... Well then, let me think of this. Jellied. <laughs> Ooh. <laughs> Jellied? The jelly. That's the opposite of what I'm thinking of. Uh, let's see, stable, the stable type. I mean, There's like only kind of one other that's kind of off, and it's cold. Strong, sturdy, substantial, tight, close, compact, <laughs> concrete, firm. The firm type. Firm type. <laughs> firm would work, I guess. Hulk, heavy, hunk, husky, material, rock, set, sound, thick, brick. <gasps> thick type. Thick, thick type. type. But thick is thick not type. what I'm going for. Yeah, I know, but thick type is funny. I, I guess it was. It's funny word. Uh, mast, hefty. What about this? Let's see. Decent, oh, sure. genuine, good, real <laughs> satisfaction. Rob, Rob. What? Wall type. I'm not having a wall type. I'm not having... The listed wall type. I'm not... <laughs> that reminds me of an anime I watched where... This Coco's head is a brick and bricks go in walls. Oh my god. I'll have thick. We got thick oh wait, uh, we got liquid still. Okay, but once you pair I'm keeping horny. liquid. We can have thick. All right, Bouncy question though. Being horny for slime. Do I do I add a C or do I add a K? Add, no, do it do it T T H I Q U E. Thick, thick way. So it's like thick, thick. <laughs> also, I had an idea for cold, <laughs> the nippy type. Oh my god. It's like, it's a bit nippy out. 
Tatin. <laughs> nah, I'm just fucking. I'm not, okay. I'm not saying I have to do this. I'm just like thinking of other things. It is a good one though, but I don't want people to think it means nipples. <laughs> yeah, it was the only thing I was thinking of. It's also like, because I, I do think cold could use maybe a different Solid. word. Solid. Just because it's just cold. Uh, I'm trying to think of funnier words for cold, but it's actually hard to think of funny words for cold. Mm. I think cold is just funny, though. It's so simple. Cold. Cold type. <laughs> Everything else thinks they're cool. They were just this guy's cold. What's that kind? Oh, he's a ghoul boost type. Oh, what's this guy? He's a cold type. He's cold. Oh. <laughs> you don't say it's like he. It's a oh. cold. You just say he's cold. He's cold. He's All right. fucking freezing. So we have level. like kind of a thing for like steel and rock type right here with thick type. Um, solid wall. How about something to do with like mystical, like elements, like like um. Uh, let me think. Scamboopily. I see crystals. I see gas. I see type type. <laughs> Weird. Wiz type. Strange. Weird type. Question mark. Question mark. Question mark. Type. Science can't explain what's happening. Cosmic. We've got Cosmic with Empty, I think. Witchcraft. Which uh, type? Ab abomination. <laughs> Suck type. Radical type. Radical. Radical Rex. <laughs> Nerd type. Nerd type. Um, <laughs> Sparkly type. Um... What about something for wait, like cute wait, wait, wait. If they're, they're like Maybe. they're like mad they're like these ones are like magical and shit, right? I guess, yeah. Rap type. Because of the rapping sorcerer. I mean He's the rap type. But it won't really make sense if someone sees rap and then they're like, oh, what does this mean? All of their moves rhyme. <laughs> <laughs> Kawaii type. I hate the word kawaii, but it would also be, actually no, it wouldn't be funny, it would be cringe. Um, how about zitty type? <laughs> no. You shut the fuck up, you're not allowed <laughs> to speak, I'm taking over this project. Uh, <laughs> you're not allowed to speak ever again. Let's see, what else do we have? There should, should be a G-U-N type. How about we have, like, this really disgusting gross type? Like, Quip. But, like, in Pokemon form. And it's just the uh type. <laughs> the uh. Just E-U-G-H. <laughs> uh. Uh. How about with an, how about with an R in there? Uh. <laughs> Cringe type. Cringe type. That, that would just be another name for the sim. We type. could make it a Quip type. Quip type. Quip would be like the pseudo legendary of the ooh type. Yeah, good idea actually. Wait, why is Quip ooh? How about virus? It could be like an in-game thing where there's been a virus and it's just completely obliterated certain species no, 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 of Pokemon. We're, we, we're, we're not allowed to do that. Why not? We're not allowed to do that. Why? Because it's like Risen Evil? Rob. What? <laughs> I think people might find that to be a bit insensitive. <laughs> <laughs> with the current uh, state of affairs. Oh, you know, God's sake, then Resident Evil is offensive right now. It's not, no, there's a di <laughs> There's no difference. Rob, please. This isn't coronavirus. Rob. It's just a virus. Look, Rob. Resident Evil Village is coming out soon and no one's saying, Oh, it's just insensitive. That's because that's a franchise. This is a new game you were creating, you're making a virus die. <laughs> I think virus type would be a good idea. Also, the game is years away. It's gonna be gone okay. by the time. You just fucking jinxed it. Good job. But it doesn't have to be called virus type, is the thing. Corona type. <laughs> Hang on, let me look up synonyms. <laughs> Sick type. Germ type. Illness. Infection. Uh, pathogen. Hang on, uh, what about if I look up words for gross? Bleh. <laughs> bleh. The bleh type. Crude vulgar. Uh, not... Fleshly. Uh... What about the flesh type? I don't want that. See that? 
This show is gross. What's another word for like disgusting? Horrific. Abominable, awful, creepy, distasteful, gruesome, hateful, horrific, loathsome, nasty, vile. How about the vile type? Ooh, the vile type. That's pretty good. That could work. The K-pop oh, type. Oh, I thought this, this is a new type. I didn't think it was replacing. Ugh. No, I think it. <laughs> well, you can keep it uh, if you want, but we could simplify it a little bit to the <laughs> ooh type. <laughs> I think the ooh uh, type is funny. It's like, uh. <laughs> it re represents that like, anytime you see it, it's like, uh. <laughs> just pure discomfort. Yeah, Spoonful agrees with me. Err is great. Like, uh. All right, all right, all right, all right. <laughs> But I would, I would, I would like you to change, like, I would like to change thick to be straight up CK. I want a hard K at the end there. Make it a big capital K. Thick. Lowercase T, thick. big case K. Thick. Uh, virus and fleshly. Wait, what if, what if it was two Ks? That's not what I meant. <laughs> You mean like this? <laughs> yeah, that, that looks like a that. child wrote it. I'm sorry. <laughs> Two C's and works. You have the mind of a Two child. Two K's does a, not. A very disturbed child. All right. What about K-pop? Okay. No. What about, what about J-pop? No. Come on, man. Go with me here. Cringe type. This cringe is this type. is where you got to say yes and. No, you're creating the cringe type right now. All right. All right. Well, How many more do types then? do we need? Like we've added a lot. All right. Well, we've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Let's go for a nice even thirteen. Okay. Yeah. That's okay. You had thirteen would be my favorite number, but don't you dare call it even. <laughs> Think of what are we, we missing were... here? What are we missing? Uh, we've got nothing really to do with the ground, do we? Like the earth. Well, I imagine the thick type would do that because, like, you know, you have like your ground attacks and she's like, "They're that's thick." You know, it's a solid wall shit. What if something's made of sand, though? That could probably fit into the thick types, and sand is a building material. It's and like... if there's walls, I suppose <laughs> it would be like a lower evolution or some shit. Crystal type would be under thick, sorry. Uh, thick is essentially any form of rock. Uh, let's see. Well, we're missing kind of like poisons. Oh, we didn't trash. get that, like we didn't get that like mythical t type thing you were on about. True, true, true. But we've got Magical. already. We've got a bunch of mythical stuff like empty and boost. Well, yeah, but I'm, those like, are kind of like very, like, very abstract. Like what about the quote-unquote psychic type stuff? Hmm. Okay. Psychic fairy, that sort of stuff. Yeah. Uh. Hmm. uh spell type is boring. Um. What's that? Um. It's like it sounds like a curse, but it's not a curse. What's the word? Hex type. Yeah, I was just looking at that actually. I was literally I, looking I up. Conjurer, Enchanter, Necromancer, Cultist, Sorcerer. Cult type, Cult type. Cult type. Um. Have you really fucked up psychic types? Voodoo. Hicks. Eh. Uh, voodoo, voodoo, Warlock. Boring. Voodoo, Enchanter, Conjurer, Magician, Charmer. But Voodoo would kind of work under Ghoul, I would imagine. Wouldn't be yeah. kind of lighter than that. What about like diviner? Uh, it's like more it's like more like it. angelic. Oracle. Nah. Yeah. What about something like holy? A holy, holy type, type of some sort, not a light type per se, but like something to do with like something angelic and shit. Let me look up holy. Yeah, because holy is a boring word. Godly, devout, pious. <laughs> Pope type. <laughs> Pope type. <laughs> 
<laughs> Moral, <laughs> pure, chest, beatified, blessed, blessed type, venerable. Hashtag blessed type. Pure. What about something to do with pure? Hang on. Undiluted, straight, refined, purified, plain, neat, fine, absolute, unmixed. The neat type. Clean. How about clean type? Untainted. Rendered, tried, concentrated, full body, strong, type, uncombined. Type. Jeebus type. Clean. I think clean sounds good. <laughs> I really like the idea of clean type being just like horrific angels with giant swords coming out from the sky, like a wheel of eyes and fire. A wheel of eyes and fire? What's that have to do with holy? Look up what an angel really looks like. I'm pretty sure I type in angel, Rob. I'm gonna get some fucking like. Oh. Look at real angel appearance. Here we go. How are angels okay, described? Yeah. Uh, here we go. Uh, angels look like. Real angel appearance. Whoa, what the fuck is that one? Wheel. Look up wheel. Yeah, I, I see the wheel of eyes. Yeah. Apparently that's the what? like true form or whatever. Why? I don't know. That's that's disturbing. I'd love to make a Pokemon based on it though. That would be a cool legendary. There's also one with like I mean, maybe four not a heads. legendary, but like a simple legendary. Yeah. That's a Derek Souls enemy. Yeah. We call it wheel type. <laughs> no. <laughs> oh, uh, okay, let's see. Um, sinless? Sinless type. Nah. Virgin? Virgin type? <gasps> because they're pure. Yeah. Virgin type. Virgin type. <laughs> I don't think I'm a virgin. No, but vir virgin would be weak to uh, what's the fem type? <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh I want to do virgin. <laughs> oh. Well, Rob, you can't do the virgin. Then it's not a virgin anymore. Virgin. All right. Yes, virgin. But if virgin, if we if we don't think of virgin, we'll change it to clean. Clean. Please don't think of virgin. Pure, holy. <laughs> All right. The virgin type. So now we're gonna try figure out what's weak against what and try balance it out a bit. Okay. Well, virgin is clearly weak to fem. Well, that's fine. <coughs> but when are we gonna make this like? I was thinking it would be weak to thick instead of fem. Because, you know, <laughs> thick thighs. <laughs> You're right, Because I was thinking fem would be a fairly common type, and I wouldn't want it to be weak against that. I agree, actually. I think maybe it could be weak also against empty. As space kind of completely gets rid of the idea of heaven being above us. You know what I mean? Okay, now you're getting philosophical. You've lost me. Well, what about a hell type? <laughs> okay, what what funny words are there for hell? Sex type. Sex type. <laughs> What's the opposite of it? Whore. Whore type. Whore type. Whore type. Or horny. All right, I think I think we've got good ones enough so far. Anyway, so let's let's take a look at what we got. So let's add a color to each one so we know what's what. So I'm gonna make fem type pink. Fem type will be pink. We've got ghoul as like a kind of like purpley color. We've got what bright yellow. We've got glide types being like a kind of like light blue. Very similar to Pokemon so far. Green. I want to make, I'm going to make this kind of like more of a turquoise salad. Empty. I want it to be like a dark, almost blue, purple. A void. Yeah. 
Almost black, really. Close to black with a tinge or something else. Well, it will have white text through it. Like, we have te white text running through it, so it will, it will be easy yeah. enough to see. Boost can be... Blue. <laughs> sure. Well, then if it's blue, then you'd have, like, four blue ones, because, like, Glide's kind of blue, Boost would be blue, Cold's going to be... Unless you make Cold, like, grayish. I was thinking, actually, about making Liquid Silver. That would be good. Like Mercury? Yeah. Uh, spicy is going to be red, of course. Ready, kind of orangey red. Yeah. Cold. Well, I need it to be different from... Man, I can make cold white. Do you think? Mm. Yeah. Like snow. Yeah. Just pure white. Uh, kind of hard to see. Look, Maybe draw like a black circle. Uh, yeah, I'm going to do that. <laughs> yeah, there we go. Thick. I, I imagine like peach or something. <laughs> it's, it'd be a bit confusing thing. I was thinking more of like a red red. Looks very similar to spicy. What about now? Maybe if you made... Okay, yeah, that, that, that is a big difference. I was about to say make spicy oranger, but that's fine. Uh, thinking of ugh, being like a brown, maybe? A brownie red? Oh, what's wrong with brown? What are you, racist? Actually, kind of <laughs> greeny yellow, actually. Yeah, I was thinking green would be more like a... Uh. Like a gross kind of color. And then virgin. Oh, wait. What colors haven't we used? Should we not make white virgin? Would virgin not... Mm. I was thinking maybe I mean, make... More like a, a Hang yellow. on, I've got an idea, I've got an idea. Cool, it's gonna be... It's just the cross. Virgin can be white, right? And I make... <laughs> and I make cold... Like a light blue, a light bluey kind of purpley almost. Well, just be careful that it's not too similar to Glide. Yeah, don't worry. Yeah, that actually looks like uh, when your face goes blue. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. Yeah, that works. And I was thinking Boost could be a little more like classic e Sonic. And Glide will be why, there. Why are you putting classic in the game? <laughs> Fiend. All right. I think that looks good. I like that. Although maybe I should make thick brown. Yeah. I think it'd be better because there's a lot of... Yeah, there'll like... be a lot of rock types and things. Mm-hmm. Whoops. That's the wrong one. Mmm, thick chocolate. <laughs> <laughs> Cold and ghoul are a bit similar. Um, yeah, they are, but I'm not ghoul sure what else I would there. do for ghoul. Maybe a dark grey? I feel like ghoul would be darker, yeah. But I'll make it slightly purple. <sighs> Alright. So let's figure out what we're doing here. Uh, Alright, so... Welcome back, milky glasses. <laughs> <laughs> Type combos. Alright. So let's get this all on a graph, eh? A graph? Yeah, a graph. Why are we putting this on a graph? Because we need to figure out what's super effective against what. How does a graph do that? You know how on the Bulbapedia? No. We can try to do a big circle. We can try. I don't know, I'm bad at these kind of things. Alright, well, hang on, let's put Fim at the top. Oh, wait, what kind of graph I probably should have asked? Just a, like a straight ass, just... Ah, okay. A right. lot smaller. Because my brain went to that, like, statistics graph, where, like, the line is going up and down. You think it'll like this? No, oh, no, you mean like, like, you know... You mean like... Yeah, that wouldn't even make sense like, here. That's why I was really confused. <laughs> I was like, what do you mean? 
team. <laughs> All right. Well, let's let's go. Let's get rid of this, and I can literally start this off as part of the graph. Okay. And I can literally flip this on its fucking side. Just like that. Easy. I should probably flip this but then it would be flipped over and I wouldn't be able to read it whatever this should work should work fine so is this a resistances chart or is this a I'm a bit confused how am I gonna do this should have made a milk type which your mother was a milk tank Ooh. I'd love to see a lot of food type Pokemon. Uh, Poco, Poco Man, sorry. Do you think we could have a food type added? Is that not what the veggie or the fucking, what is it, flora? It's one salad, is? dude. Salad, yeah. S salad is food or something? I suppose salad could be kept as food. Unless you want, like, well. I feel like living meat Pokemon will be weird. <laughs> They'll be thick. thick as Unless fuck. you meant like having things like buns and shit. Like, yeah, well that's what, that's what I meant, yeah. So maybe we should change salad to something hmm. else. Well then you don't have a grass type. Yeah, true. Hmm. You could just add another type. We could add another type. The yummy type? I <gasps> yummy type, yummy type. I love yummy type. I'm looking up yummy synonyms. It, it could be like a Y U M M I. Oh, that's actually, I like that. Uh, let's see. Y Appetizing, delectable, delightful, juicy, luscious, piquant, savory, spicy, succulent, tasty. Tasty type. Choice. Uh, divine, enticing, fit for a king, good, heavenly, mouth watering, nectarious. Nectarous, <laughs> out of this world, palatable, pleasant, rich, sapid. What does sapid mean? Scrumptious, know, super sweet, gross. tasteful, tempting, toothsome. I think yummy type works. Sapid literally just means tasty. That's stupid. What about yeah, tes I'm, I'm tasty? On, I'm on yummy type. Oh, well, mm. yummy sounds cuter, and I imagine if you're doing food things, they'd be kind of adorable. Yeah, they would be. All right. I'll agree with that. Let's do it. Can there be one that's just the shallow one? That could work, actually. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> right. Let's go up here. This would have been a lot more helpful if I'd done this before, and this wasn't. Right. Fem plus yummy equals orgasmic. <laughs> I have heard a story about like, someone told me where they described like food they had re that was really good as a chocolate orgasm. Oh. It was weird. <laughs> it was funny though. Uh, eat off you fucking wind bastard. What? I'm trying to get Venti to eat. Playing games at a time like this. Uh, making I'm important just, decisions for the future. I'm, I'm kind of like AFK playing, and mine's not actually focusing on, I'm just kind of like, doing it. Uh, let's see. Yummy type can be... Um... <gasps> well, we don't yet have the Radical Soda Red, so... Here we go. But well, then that's really similar to... Oh, we know Thick was changed, right? Okay. So how does Pokemon do this? Let's look up their graph first of all. On Bulbapedia. Uh, kite shot Bulbapedia. All right. So this is how you guys can see what I'm talking about. Uh, let's cut this and I'll put it on the Photoshop. All right. 
Should make things pretty simple. Number nine. <coughs> All right. Here we go. Show. Attacking on the left, defending on the right. That makes things a lot easier. What? So. What so does that mean? These what ones are uh, attacking on left, defending on right. Well, if you were looking at the stream, you'd know. I am. I don't know. No, but like... Attacking. All right. So the ones on the left are attacking. The ones on the right are defending. So, for example, fight is going to do two damage to normal. Oh, I under... okay. No, I just couldn't actually understand what the the table on the right was telling me. So you look on the left to see the attack going off, and you see how this person defends against it. Yeah, yeah, I get it now. So, let's start with an easy one. Uh, I would say, now, because I'm going to have to do this multiple times, let's put this on another layer. Uh, t t times amount. <laughs> All right, sure. Would it be a good idea to save what it is now? And yeah, I, I, have it, change it? I have it on a different okay, layer. Yeah. So even if I do this... Nice. I can just literally get rid of it. That's me. Big brain. Alright. So. Here we go. So what are we going to do here? So. We said Thick was going to do extra damage to Virgin. Yep. So times two. So if Thick is attacking Virgin, which is here, it does times two. And then Virgin still also do less damage. So I'm going to make that green. Make the color green here. Actually, you know what? I'll put it under it. That'll make things easier. Here we go. There we go. So times two. Shall we just start with Virgin? Because that one's going to be one of the easiest ones <laughs> to do. Well, we have kind of already have started. Yeah. All right. Finn beats Virgin. No, I, I was thinking that Finn would be a very common type, and I want Virgin to be a very strong type. So, I think... It beats School. I think that's a good idea, yeah. Virgin beats... Yeah. Uh, so, if I go Virgin to Ghoul, where's Ghoul? Ghoul's Holy third last. Be, I imagine Holy would also beat Ghoul. Pardon? Holy Vir Virgin is Holy, right? I got my wires crossed. Yeah. So that's times it's two. It's good to have this all sorted before we start, just in case. Oh, but then we so can always change it later, of course. Left and cry. We can release patches. So, uh, let's see what else. Virgin. Um, what else would be attacking Virgin and not doing much damage? Nintendo should hire these people. <laughs> That means that Ghoul would do half damage? Yes. Or should we say that Ghoul does no damage to Virgin? I'd say half. Mm. Well, the way Pokemon does it is uh, like if you, if you can hit the enemy, the enemy wouldn't also do deal damage to you. With that well, type. how about we have Ghoul do half damage to Virgin, and we have Empty do no damage to Virgin? That means Virgin would also be able to do no damage to Empty. No. In fact, it's the other way Pokemon, around, Virgin would do times two damage. That's the way Pokemon would do it. If you can't deal damage, it's like it's like if it's not effective. But it? MD would have like an extra bonus on things like I don't know other things. I don't know. I just feel like because Empty completely disproves Virgin. Wait, no, other way around then. Virgin does no damage to Empty. How about that? But that means it can't do damage back. Hmm. But that means it can't do damage back. That's, I'm sure that's not always how that works. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah no, sure. no, 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 no. It's not. Dragon can't attack Fairy, but Fairy does times two damage to Dragon. Plus, this isn't Pokemon. This is our game. You literally said a minute ago, how does Pokemon do this? <laughs> yeah, but I'm just looking up how to do the fucking thing. And you're looking at Pokemon's thing right now. Uh, all right, so I'm gonna do that. So empty also, attacking Virgin. Also, I feel Virgin. like to avoid a lawsuit or people getting mad might need a name change. Yeah, we'll we'll, we'll change it. Don't worry. <laughs> <laughs> I do like Poco though. How about just like 
Have a poco. No, I think having P.O.K. at all is enough to pe for people to be all like, hmm. I'm sure there's things. Bye-bye, Mr. Person Man, sir. Bye-bye. I would actually say this. I would actually say that Salad is super effective against Glide. Why? Because Logic. it it would be a reference to the videos where I always land on the grass and hurt myself. Ain't I a genius? I don't know if I agree with the genius part, but sure. Uh, what is this? The Virgin attacking. There we go. Alright, uh, zero times. Alright. You're weak to Bear Grylls type? <laughs> Bear Grylls. Uh, alright. I just want to finish off this Virgin thing. So, Virgin attacks. Let's see, what do we got? I just want Ghoul. to finish off this Virgin thing. <laughs> Every Virgin ever. <laughs> You do times two to ghoul. Uh, wasn't it that we do half damage to thick? Yes. Okay. Thick is third one. So that's red. What are you clicking about? I'm skipping through dialogue. Don't you click on my goddamn stream. Okay, fine. You heard him, guys. Don't click on the stream. Leave. That's right. No, that means you have to click. You said to click, I did it. No! It means you have to you click to I go have... off of it. But you can't click anymore, is what I'm saying. No, he said don't click on the Should screen. we have a normal type equivalent where a type has no weakness or strength? Um I don't I don't think that's really needed to be honest. Normal types are boring. Yeah, I think Fem is like kind of our normal type. But even then, for fun, it still has its type advantages. Yeah. There's gonna be a lot of fem types. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I'm, I'm glad that's a thing. How do I turn off the NSFW filter on my phone? I can't tell what some people are saying. I don't know, fucking room. Google it. <laughs> Alright, let's see. Uh, so, Virgin against Virgin. Virgin v Virgin. <laughs> Whoever wins gets to no longer be a virgin. We can make it something stupid like times five. <laughs> this thing, it doesn't have to be times two. Hmm. We could have that virgins can't do anything against each other. That could be interesting. Or it could be that virgins just don't want to hit each other. They don't want to fight each other. They have to work together to get the pussy. I th actually, I think it should be virgins do more damage to virgins because they're competing. <laughs> they're competing. Good to idea, actually. Virgins. Good idea, good idea. Not a bad one. <laughs> All right. Alright, so, currently, Virgin is weak to two things. Virgin and Thick. I think that's enough if I, we want it to be the strongest type. I think the other strongest type should be probably Empty and... I would say Ugh. Those would be the three mm. three major types. I don't think Ugh will be one of the major types. The Ugh will be one that people probably wouldn't use just because it would look weird. I want Ugh what? to be like a really disgusting looking, horrifying monster creature creations. Like something that doesn't look even look like it belongs in the game. Something Ugh horrifying that, with, with blood oh. everywhere. Like that sort of shit. Oh. <laughs> like disgusting <laughs> creatures from the underworld. Like. Yeah, so that's, see, that's, that's going to make people not use Ugh. Is what I'm th Ugh, it reminds me of like the trubbish of this game. 
Well, I'm sure they'll be cute, ugh, as well, but I want there to be just absolutely disgusting nightmares. I don't want it to just be all cute. Well, Who here I'm would sure. use disgusting creature hideous from the underworld? Like, full of blood and guts and, like, horrifying teeth and claws, and I've got my hand up. Does it have tits? That angels you were on about earlier would be ugh and virgin type. <laughs> It, de it would depend on... There we go, the we got someone already. Yeah, well, that's the thing. It would it, still be, it would it still would be depend. like, you'd still want to use it. It'd still look cool. It wouldn't just be completely disgusting, but... Anyway, a lot of people would say that. I think it is, I, I'm just thinking of the flesh types again. <laughs> like, horrifying, more like. Like, imagine a scary Pokemon, rather than, you know. I'm thinking like a messy blob whenever I think of like, ooh. <laughs> Not... Well, yeah, there'll also be messy blobs, but give us an example. Um, uh, you know how Quip had like a mouth with tentacles instead of a vagina? What? There you go. That's no, that. No, 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 no. That sentence made. How could she have a mouth of tentacles instead of a vagina? That's what she has. She's literally. She looks like this. She's like. Uh, hang on. Let me. Uh, I can't remember what Quip looks like, actually. She's got, like, little... Rob. She's got little ears. But, but your mouth... The mouth and the vagina are not the same thing. <laughs> why would you have a... Why would having a mouth of tentacles mean you don't have a vagina? You'll see why. You're seeing... You're seeing the problem here. No, you're, you're not seeing... You're not looking... Like, hard enough. This is what Quip is. I think I did the hair very wrong, but... Sure, the frog doesn't know that yet. He hasn't found out. <laughs> yeah, guys, I don't think Rob knows what women are. It's like... But he draws, draws them all the time because they're fantasy creatures to him. Like that. It's not a mouth. It is. It's a mouth of teeth and tentacles and disgusting things. Rob, when you say mouth, someone would immediately think the mouth on your face. No, it's a mouth down below. You never... S uh, you should say mouth where the vagina would be, not a mouth instead. Yes. All right, all right. Uh, I think... Oh I think. God. What do we think about Ur versus Virgin? I'm actually thinking that maybe we should change Thick to... I feel like Virgin would win that fight because a Virgin is desperate. No fuck anything. Then it's very super effective against a lot of types. There would only be a few Virgins. <laughs> <laughs> I was thinking we could change its super effective Virgin's typing like, yeah. on thick and move it over to er instead. Yeah. I think that would make more sense. Wait. Wait, yeah, virgin's going to be weak to thick. What no, virgin, virgin, against virgin, uh, virgin against virgin, sorry. Virgin against virgin is two times. Virgin, virgin does damage virgin. to ghoul. What if virgin against virgin is just a 1.5 times? Hmm? What if virgin against virgin is 1.5 times instead? Why is that? I don't know, just to change it? No. <laughs> It'd make it a little harder to determine how much damage things are going to do, I reckon. Is it, are we putting are we putting them. critical hits in this game? Uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna say I'm gonna say no critical hits unless you make it a thing yourself. You know, like uh, you know, like uh, bulk up or something. No, not bulk up. It's like something that gets you like ready in the game. Basically, what you're saying is drugs, performance enhancement drugs. <laughs> oh. Oh. Uh, where's Ur? It does half damage to Ur. And mm. Ur does um, times two damage to Virgin. I think that's a good idea. I want Ur to be like the bane of its existence. Okay. That's Virgin. Uh, done, I think. 
So a virgin attacks thick, it's just times one. If it attacks liquid, it's just times one. If it attacks cold, it's just times one. It attacks spicy, it's just times one. It attacks boost, it's just times one. Empty, it's times zero. Salad, times one. The other one, it's times one. Watt, it's times one. Fem, it's times one. And yummy, it's times one. What do you think of that? We're getting somewhere. Hmm. How about Fem? We'll, we'll do this one pretty easy. Um, Fem v Virgin is times one again, I assume. Pardon? Fem v Virgin is times one, wouldn't it be? Yes. Yeah. Because if it's times one one way, it'll be times one the other way. Well, no, it doesn't have to be, actually. See, look at this. For example, if I look at uh, Fairy, uh, for example, Fairy against Dragon here is times two. But like, if I look at Dragon versus Fairy, it's times zero. Well, that's if we have one that's literally null and void against it. But it also can change things like, well, look at this. Bug versus fighting times half. Uh, fighting versus bug is also times half. But then that doesn't make sense with things like, um, let's say, flying versus grass times two. You look at grass versus flying, it's times half. So you can change things around. like it. No, but I meant like if one's times one one way, wouldn't it be times one the other way? Because they can mm, even fight. Not always. Like, for example, uh, Steel might do regular... Oh, I thought our game was in Pokemon. Oh, we're not making Pokemon. Well, I'm not going to... I'm not going to follow... You're only following these rules because you think it's from Pokemon. <laughs> you silly bitch. What you're doing? I'm thinking Earth should be times two on Femme. Uh. I think it's a good idea. I think the females would be very grossed out by Earth. The females. The way I'm fucking talking. Wait, what? I just want to it. Uh, thick. Mm. I, I feel like thick and femme should work together somehow. I think I'll just do times one for now. Liquid times one. Cold times one. Spicy times one. Boost times one. Empty times one. Salad times one, glide times one, watt times one, ghoul times one, fem versus fem. Uh, we can make fem half damage against other fems, but they do times two to yummy. <laughs> yummy, 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 tummy. I think it's a, that's a, that's an interesting it's idea. Just, ben wants to eat the food. Yeah, it's going to be like cute foods, honey buns and stuff. I haven't been reading chat much, have you? Uh, no, I haven't. We should probably do that. There's not a lot of things there's that... No, I'm not saying you guys are... No. I'm not saying it being boring. I'm just saying there's not a lot of things to read that I should extend there or I can say anything about. Well, let's see. Um, an idea. Females go all out when they fight against each other. Well, eh. hang on. That means that every time a femme Pokemon is sent out, in my way anyway, the other, po the other person will just send out Something else, not a fem Pokemon. Mostly seen it an Earth Pokemon. But if we have fem versus fem and they do damage to each other, then if they stay in, it's like a risk reward kind of thing, like dragons. But you have it at times half. Yeah, but if I change it to times two instead, I think that could be more interesting. Yeah. This isn't going to be balanced in the slightest. We're going to have to figure out balancing later on, but. We'll just do what's interesting for now and what makes the most sense to us. 
I try not to give them too many weaknesses and too many things. Uh, okay, what were we gonna do? Urgh? Same time, I think like if you have like favorite things that are like you know like oh I really like this design, you should be like you know, they should be viable. Hmm. Because so people are gonna want to use their ones. Yeah. But if you make a Pokemon just shit, but it's a really nice design, people are gonna be mad. Like oh. True. All right, why don't we try um, why don't we try Yummy next? Because I've already got one of them. So Yummy versus version will just be times one, I guess. Does regular damage to Virgin. Or we could say it does half damage to Virgin. Because they don't need to eat. <laughs> Why would Virgins not need to eat? Because they're so focused on getting that pussy. <laughs> they're, star they're giving all their food to their queens. There you go. Wait, that's more of a simp thing to do. But a Virgin could be a simp. Oh wait, do we not have a simp type? Hmm? We oh, I thought we had a simp type, never mind. No. You're right. Um. Spooky, spooky, pump, spooking. Let's think. Let's think of um stuff for yummy then. Well, we know Fim uh will be. It will be weak to Fim. So it does half to Fim. It's easy enough. What about food versus food? Half. Half damage, I think. Yeah, I'd say half damage. <laughs> I'm sorry this is if this is boring for anyone, but this is very exciting for me. Finally getting like the ideas for a game down. Without having to worry about like, oh my god, I'm wasting time. Would thick be strong against cold because they have more fat to deal with cold? Good idea. Ooh. So we'll have cold do half damage uh, to lick, uh, not liquid, to thick. Uh, Would thick do any more damage against cold though? Um, I guess, I guess so. How much? Well, times two. Okay. And then where's thick against cold? Cold is here. So times two. It's a bit of an odd setup, this graph, but we're getting there. Okay. Is thick weak to empty? Um, I don't know. I'll have to sort that out, but first we're doing yummy. Yummy. So Yummy does half damage to... Yeah, alright. Half damage to two things. I would say... Do you think Yummy should do zero damage to Virgin? Or just half? Uh... Or do you think it should do half damage to Ghoul? If Ghouls don't need to eat. I don't know. If it's a Ghoul! Maybe it should do no damage to Ghoul? What's that? Maybe you should do no damage to Ghoul. Yeah. Hmm. We could make them weak to know. liquid. Because <laughs> if liquid falls on your meal, you're really not going to be interested in eating it. Uh, think about it, it's like you put gravy on food and shit, you put cream on food. Icing is a liquid before it solidifies. What about spice? How about we add like an extra thing where like... Maybe any spicy moves like... Gives it... Oh no, that could be like an ability for it, rather. Spicy type powers it up. <laughs> like if you, have a, <laughs> if you have a noodle based Pokemon, you add spice to it, like it's... Powers it up, it gives it extra attack or something. E. Uh, all right. Um, well, let's just do the ones we know. Uh, what was that? Urk does... Fem does half damage, so Urk does times two to Fem. Easy enough. It's got to be at least somewhat balanced to start off with. I can't just fucking throw everything in at once. Let's read some of the chat, what the chat's thinking. Spice. 
Spicy versus Cold next? Spicy would win. I think Spicy would win in that scenario. Spicy heats up your inside, which makes your outsides warm. That's right. So Cold doesn't do much to Spicy. So let's go the half damage for Spicy. Yeah. <laughs> times one half. And if I can find spicy against cold, it does times two. Looking good. Unfortunately, cold isn't looking so great. So far, we've got two things that do super effective to cold. Is there anything that cold would resist? Or do more damage to? Would the, can ice conduct electricity? Very much so, yes. Yeah, I was thinking like. In fact, it, 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 it conducts electricity very much so, I think. <laughs> Wait, let me check. Let me check. Um, uh, it could be flying and spin. Does ice conduct electricity? It depends how much like gross stuff oh, is in it. Cold, oh, cold ice is a poor use... conductor of electricity. In water, these ions are mobile, allowing for conduction, but because ice is a solid, the ions present are not mobile, making ice yeah, a very poor conductor. Okay. okay, I was the opposite. All right, sorry, I must have read yeah. that wrong somewhere. So I Let's guess we'll make that... cold resist. Cold, what? Cold can be strong against water and liquid, since it would freeze liquids. Sounds good. Should we make cold do times two to what? Or should we just make it resist it outright? I don't think we resist it outright because it's a poor conductor, not a not electric not electric proof. Oh, sorry. I mean, uh, should we have like when cold attacks a what type? Should we have it do more damage? Uh, or just do regular maybe? damage? Maybe a bit more damage, just because it's like, it's like nullifying it. Well, we'll give it times two for now. Yeah. Doesn't have to make perfect sense. I mean, I think about it this way. Rock type is super effective against flying type. like. <laughs> <laughs> and that comes from the saying, uh, uh, it, what, it's a, a, a stone, two, bird, stone. two birds, one stone, yeah. Wait, okay, that, so that's two know? times on cold. Whoops, that was wrong. In one of my Discord group chats, a bunch of my friends are like, fucking... They're after renaming... Do you, do you know what Mr. Price is? Uh, I don't. It's basically a, a bargain shop. Basically, everything's much cheaper than anywhere else. But it's also like usually like shit stuff. Oh, okay. So it's good. But like, their logo is just some like really buff dude, and like a bunch of my friends are like, fucking, he's so hot, goddamn. They're all just <laughs> fucking, they're all simply over Mr. Price all of a sudden. They're doing like that, uh, that wolf theme where it's like a woo. <laughs> <laughs> I like the idea of, uh, sorry, I like the idea of Earth doing double damage to Yummy. Because you get dirt in your food. Yeah, pretty much. That's gross. Yummy has two times halves already. We haven't given it anything else. Yeah. Oh, it'd be super effective against uh, Fem, wouldn't it? Yeah, we've already given it a super effective against Fem. No, we give Fem super. Oh wait, yeah, we give Fem super effective against Yummy. That's right. And Earth is doing be, super effective against too. It could be times two both ways. What Fem and Yummy? Yeah. Why? Because they eat it so quickly, but it also packs on the calories. <laughs> I was gonna say because it's the food is irresistible, but sure. I was thinking, yummy could be super effective to, against glide, because the oh, more you makes, it <laughs> makes you glide. heavier, yeah. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna do that. All right, I got a times two on that one. Anything else that yummy would be good against? Salad. That's just leaves and stuff. Empty? Should we say yummy would be super vegan against empty? Yummy would be empty. Because it fills it up? Yeah. It makes it feel better by killing it. 
by filling it up, the and therefore it is not empty, and therefore it is not it, it, alive. The logic is flawed, but it works. It works, it works. Okay, spicy. Uh, I think that can just be regular, I think. Uh, cold. A nice, Chili. a nice warm meal to heat you up. Mm. That's mm. kind of with spicy, isn't it? Liquid? That is liquid. Um. Um. I feel like liquid might just be a times one. Let's just do everything that we know that'll be times one. Ghoul? Emmy versus Ghoul? That would probably be a times one. Well, actually, I don't know. I'll just do times one for now. Yeah. Versus... Oh, that was... Is that Glide? Yeah, that's Glide. Okay, what? We should, we should have a lot of times ones. Yeah, there should be a lot of times ones, yeah. Uh, versus Salad, times one. Uh, what's next? Uh, boost? It said that Sonic needs to eat a lot of calories. <laughs> if we're basing this off of Sonic. No. No! Could make boost super effective against it. Uh, let's see what else. Thick? Virgin with food. I'll just do times one. So far, Virgin's looking like one of the more weaker Pokemon, but it doesn't have many um, weaknesses. Yeah. It looks like it'll be a good all rounder. Apart from if it's fighting an Ooh. Or a Virgin. <laughs> <laughs> or a Virgin. <laughs> It does resist thick though. No, it resists uh? No. No, it does half no, damage it, to uh. Yeah. That's right. What does it resist? Boost. No. Empty. We need to make it resist more. So far it doesn't resist anything. Why does it resist empty? Hmm? Why is why can't it damage empty? Uh because empty makes it not exist. That's not... Why... Because it's based on space. You ever, you ever heard of the Tower of Babel? It's, it's not pronounced Babel, but go on. Well, whatever. What is it, how's it pronounced? It's like Babel or something. Like Babylon. Babel. Well, anyway. Tower of Babel. Tower of Babel. Whatever it is. But what do virgins have to do with space? You see, the whole reason why they created that tower was to get closer to heaven, to get closer to God, right? If God truly was upwards, then space wouldn't be there, it'd be heaven. The empty is supposed to be about space, about the nothingness of space, and how there is no heaven. Therefore, there is no virgin slash holy land slash holy Pokemon. Pokemans. Pokemon. Yeah. I think it's a good idea. That's deep, bro. I think it is deep. Anyway, uh, let's get rest of, do the rest of the yummies. Uh, let's see what generally Pokemon have. they have at least they have at least a couple of differences. You don't want to be chucked into a bunch of times ones per se. Uh, boost. Let's just make that times one. Spicy times one. Sure. Uh. Does half damage to Ugh. We know that. Okay. Uh, thick. Times two damage to thick because it makes it thicker. Or would that be a problem? Wouldn't that be a problem? I think that would be a problem. I'm going to make it do half. <laughs> or maybe it does no damage. Because it just eats it and it just gets thicker. I think Shallow's dead. I think he's dead, guys. 
Hmm? Oh, there he is. I'm like half falling asleep, sorry. That's alright, you can go to bed if you want. Yeah, I might disappear. That's alright. I'm gonna continue on with this. Who knows, I might appear in the chat at some point if I wake up again. What? Or, not wake up, but if I just appear again. So I'm probably not gonna go to bed, but I'm probably gonna like just sit there. Okie dokie. So yeah, maybe back later. Probably not. See you. Bye bye. Uh, I think liquid times one. I think cold times one. But I think Yummy should be an all rounder. I think it should be. I think spicy should be weak to food, to be honest. I'm thinking because spicy makes food bitter. When you have spicy food, it makes it bitter. So I'm thinking it does more damage to spicy. Does anyone disagree? What do you guys think? I think that works. How do I have 39 viewers just doing this fucking shite? <laughs> We're making a Pokemon game! <laughs> Yay! <laughs> you guys aren't even paying attention. That's fine. Keep me on in the background if you want someone to chatter in the background. Uh, what was I going to do? I was going to change so spicy doesn't do damage to uh, yummy. So I got to find spicy yummy down there. So it does half damage. There we go. That's good. And then... Let's see. So Urch has been doing a lot of damage to these ones. What is it? What is Urch weak against? Because Urch does extra damage to Femme, Yummy, and Virgin <laughs> types. But I'm thinking it should resist more rather than do damage. So I think that's the maximum amount of... Wait, why is that times one? <laughs> why did I do times one there? It's got to be a two. All right, there we go. I think it should resist anything... Anything natural. So I think salad it should resist. Salad is more about the trees and the plants and things. You, you you were worried about the ice cream Pokemon? Oh wait, no, I need it to resist it. Wait. But it's doing already two times damage to everything else. Uh... It should be weak to some things too, shouldn't it? Because Ur was super effective against... It does, it does half damage... It does super effective damage to Virgin, okay. So I need to be weak to something. I think I'll make it weak to the cold. Maybe weak to the cold and weak to electricity? That could make sense. I guess. Spicy could be yummy because it could have a burning effect. Well, no, that's what I was thinking. When you add something spicy to something, it makes it better. Like, if you have, like, just these noodles, and you add a bit of spice to those noodles, it makes it better. So I was thinking yummy beats spicy. You, you get me? Thinking something related to preferences at the beginning of the game. If someone likes spicy food, then it changes its effectiveness against yummy. <laughs> or yummy, I should call it. Um, that is an idea. It'd be too complicated for me to program, though. But I think I, I think the way I've got it right, I, it's always it's relegated to change. Like it, it can it can change at any time, so I wouldn't worry too much. I'm just trying to think of what this thing could be beaten by. So Urk will do half damage to cold. It'll make sense. 
It's hard to balance things. All right. And then we've got, uh, it'll do half damage against what? Because I'm thinking electricity and cold is the best way to beat things with, uh, maybe weak to spicy as well, actually. You know, lighting it on fire would kill it. I think that's a good idea as well. Anything like any horror movie tropes of how they used to kill things, like for example, The Thing in the original movie was actually stopped with the intense cold until they broke it out of the ice. Uh, and then you've got that they killed it with flamethrowers. This is what I'm thinking of, like The Thing, when I'm thinking of, ugh. Uh, and then I would imagine electricity would kill monsters too. I've seen that a lot of times in horror movies or horror games use electricity to kill a monster. Um, so I think that could work pretty well. Thick is weak against thick because it burns fat. <laughs> I'm not sure what, what that means, but... You mean like because they're fighting each other? I think everything else should be times one. Uh, okay. Let's think of Thick then. And what Thick's gonna be doing against uh, all of its things. Or maybe something we've already kind of done. What about Cold? How do we do Cold first? So Cold is regular against Virgin. Cold does regular damage to... Wait, no, it does double damage to Ur. Uh, that's right. But so does uh, Spicy. And so does... What was it again? What? I really want Urk to be like a, like a really horror tropey kind of hard thing to take down. I want it to be quite powerful. Same with the Virgin. <laughs> I don't think we'll keep Virgin. <laughs> we'll probably change it to like uh, Holy or Clean, Pure, something along that, those lines. Cold Strong against Boost? That would make sense. You can't run if you're cold. Altristic could be weak against Boost, I suppose, because it just powers them up. Uh, but right now, let's just keep doing Cold. Uh, liquid against Cold. Uh, the Cold would freeze the Liquid. I would imagine in most instances. But what if something's liquid type and it has magma? Then it would turn to rock. And it's if it's cold. So technically, yes, yeah, still weak. Okay, I think liquid should be cold should be strong against liquid. That makes sense. I feel like. <laughs> Involved to <in> non virgin. <laughs> Virgin equals wizard. <laughs> cold should not be effective against thick. Oh, yeah, that could... Yeah, of course, because they've got a thick insulation. That's right, because we had times two against cold. That's right. Good thinking. Wait, no, that's virgin. Hang on. Yeah, cold is already not super big against thick. Hang on, I've already done that. You just threw me off. Cold will be half effective and gets cold. You can't fight cold with cold. Just doesn't make sense. Cold against cold. Doesn't do much. You can't fight a sun eye cold with a sun eye cold. Let's see. Cold against boost. We'll do double damage. We just talked about that. You realize that Virgin having times two against Ur works even more because the Virgin always survives slash dies last in a horror movie trope? Didn't I have Virgin... weak to Ur? Yeah, Virgin doesn't do any damage to Ur. Does half damage. I was gonna have Virgin being one of the only things that could take it down. 
Then again, I guess Empty could be taking it down. Hmm. Not a bad idea, but if we get rid of that, Ur loses a lot of its value. Because then it'll, it's only super effective against Yummy Fem. And that's literally it. And then it's got three things it's weak to. And then, no, then it had four things it's weak to. Which would make it a very weak... A, a, a weak... Uh, type. I was just thinking because Earth is just so out of this world. Disgusting. That it just absolutely destroys the pureness of the Virgin. <laughs> I hate speaking about this type. Ugh. Anyway, uh, we've got that sword. Let's do the thick one next. Thick versus virgin. Thick uh, versus ugh. Thick versus liquid. Spicy. I'd imagine thick wins over spicy. Because you're insulated? No. I think you should lose if you're thick. Against spicy, but no, no, what if it's like a big brick wall and you just try to hurl fire at it? Doesn't really work, does it? What about Yumi? What about Fem? Should it be strong against Fem? It's already strong against Cold and Urgh. So I'd say maybe give it one or two more strengths. Mostly one. I would rather have it just have one extra strength. That could be weak to spicy, the same reason it's strong against cold. Oh yeah, right. Good idea. There's a lot of things that don't do much damage to spicy. Wait. Cold does half damage to spicy. Oh no, it does double to liquid. Alright, uh, thick... Times half against spicy. Uh, what about liquid? So against liquid, so it's a boost. I guess that could be weak to boost. Because boost would be so much faster than it. I can imagine that. We've got to give boost some powers. And that boost is almost doing nothing. <laughs> Spice makes boost faster due to the heat. That could make sense. Thick versus empty. I'd say just times one that. Unless thick fills up the space. Uh, salad, thick versus salad. I'd say just times one. Salad's looking like almost nothing's going on here. Uh, glide versus thick. I would say glide wins over thick. Thick's too heavy, stays on the ground, keeps getting whacked by Glide. I suppose that makes sense. Thick versus what? I think Thick should resist what, but I don't think it should be super effective against it. So I'm having that times one, but I'm going to have what do half damage to Thick. I want Thick to be a really resistful Pokemon. It's fat conductive. <laughs> yeah, but I want this to be like more like rubber than fat at this point. A ghoul? Um, uh... Ghoul, Fem, Yummy. Oh, Jesus. Christ, that scared me. <laughs> Thank you, Unit 038, Danny. Oh, yeah. Keep up the good work, Red. Thanks, man. I'm making a Pokemon chart. Hope it turns out good. All right, let's see. I could go for another thing Thick is strong against. 
or at least another thing it resists. It doesn't have to be super strong against everything, it could just resist a lot of things. What else would it, would it resist? Ghoul, Femme, Yummy, Virgin, Ugh, Liquid. I think Liquid should be times one, I don't see any correlation between those two. Thick should revis resist Femme. Any reason behind that? That could absorb impact. Absorb impact of what? Uh, uh, times one. Vim doesn't have a lot of halves is all. Um. Yeah, but Vim's meant to be kind of, um, just general. Just normal. Does double damage to itself. Does double damage to Yumi. And then it's half does damage to her. Uh. Could do that. Could do that. It's It does half damage to... To that. You might be right. I think that's maybe a good idea. If we make thick, just resist more stuff, means we can just have it do regular damage to a lot of things. And seeing as it resists one of the most popular types in the game, <laughs> there you go, we can just make the rest times one. I think that works well. So it doesn't do, it doesn't have that many super effective, and it has a couple that it's not very good against, but it resists a lot. That makes sense. It resists electricity, it resists Femme, even though it doesn't have any super, like, even though it doesn't do extra damage to them. Could Thick have no effect on Urgh? Being fat is it helpful in horror movies? <laughs> not a bad idea. Not a bad idea. Tell you what, it could have a lot of resistances, but you throw it in Urgh, and it's done. I might need to give it another resistance though, if that's the case. Maybe it could also resist something else. Maybe it could resist... Blech. Blech. It already resists Femme. Would it resist Salad? <laughs> Could it resist Salad? Or would Salad be super effective against it? I don't know. It's a good idea for Thick to... Hang on, it, it resists... How many things does Thick resist? Thick, here we go. So it resists that, resists that, resists that. Resist that. It resists four things. It'd be nice if it could resist five. Maybe we could have it resist, um... Thick resists boost. Thick could beat salad because it needs to be thin. You're saying it could resist salad? I, I could, I could see that. I'll just have it resist salad. I don't want it to have too many strengths. I want this one to be like a good tank option. Kind of. Not always, but like... I just don't want it to have too many super effective abilities. So it does... Wait, why does it do times two on thick? Why do I have thick v thick going strong here? Hang on. Why is that a thing? Why is thick v thick super effective? I think what I might do is do that times one. And then it's only strong against cold. Because you can't have too much thick. Sumo? Tackle a sumo wrestler? <laughs> With the boost? I don't think Thick should... I don't think two tanks going at it and smashing each other and absolutely destroying each other is really a great idea. 
I think you guys might might be right with the boost. Maybe it should just resist boost. So if I go thick, so boost doesn't do much damage. Okay, to thick. So now it only has one super effective thing it's super effective against, but it has a bunch it's resistant to. So you can throw it into absorb a move, and then it can do a little bit of damage before it goes down. I think that makes sense. Now, uh, let's do cold, because we're almost done with cold here. It's got a bunch of different things. Um, let's see, empty. Let's just go times one on that. Does regular damage to empty. Salad. Cold salad, that's fine. There are such things as cold salads. Gliding. Uh, if you try to glide in the cold, you can't really do it. Maybe glide should do little damage to... Con no, I should probably not add too many of those things in. Ghoul times one. And cold fem times one. Yummy. Frozen food. Maybe this could be super. Maybe it could be super effective against food. Because if you freeze food, it's frozen. It's a generally pretty well accepted thing. Freeze food. Are there any Pokemon that have a lot of like super effective things they could do against? But what does this got? It's got like f it's got two, but it's got three weaknesses. Okay, can't have it being too powerful. I need it to do less damage to something else too. Less damage to... Uh, empty? It's empty. Space is already cold. Do half damage to empty. There we go. Then it's got four things it does half against and four things it's strong against. Fairly balanced, I think. That, that makes sense, I think. We should work on others like Bug when we get the chance. Uh, there is no Bug type. We've got we've got this. Uh, let's 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 finish off our thick down below. So, Ghoul would do regular damage to Thick. I think we had that all sorted out. Glide would do regular damage to Thick. Wait, would Glide do double damage to Thick? Hang on, Thick. Where's Glide? Over here. Half damage. Yeah, Glide does double, double damage to Thick. Makes sense. It just swoops in and smashes its head. I think that, make, that makes a lot of sense. Uh, salad. Does Salad do times two to Thick? Was that what we were doing? Uh, salad, 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 salad times one. Okay, no. No, we'll just do times one for salad. Empty. Did we do anything with empty? No. Times one. It resists a bunch of times. Actually, it doesn't resist that many types at all. It resists one, two, three, four, five. There's only one extra. Generally speaking. Hmm. How about salad doesn't do much to thick? That would make sense, right? It's just salad, though. It only... If you eat healthy, you won't be thick anymore. Hmm. True. We could have Yummy do half... Oh, it already does. <coughs> Spicy. I could just leave it like this for now. I don't want it to have any more weaknesses at the moment, so. How about empty do half? Fat boys can go for a while on empty. <laughs> I was thinking maybe thick v thick don't, doesn't do much. Stop things from thicks from fighting each other. They just get tired and they just start slapping each other. I think that might work. And then it does resist other stuff too. So it's like rock v rock or steel v steel. 
half 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 against each other. And then it resists six technically. That should be good. All right. So what's what's next on the on the list? Shall we do which one do you guys want to do next? That should fill the emptiness. <laughs> Where's empty anyway? Empty is up here. That just does regular damage. Let's do glide. Okay. Uh, let's see. Gliding up to an angel. How will that end? I think that would end poorly. I think we should do half of that. Let's say Glide doesn't doesn't do much to the Virgin. We can change it if we need to. No issues there. Glide versus Urgh. I would say it's just times one. Uh, glide v Liquid. I would say it doesn't do much against Liquids. To be honest. I'd say if it lands in a Liquid, it, it's kind of done for. Uh, versus the Cold. I'd say it does regular damage versus the cold, but it's weak to the cold, if that makes sense. Uh, have I done that? Where's F Glide? Oh, cold is... Oh yeah, because I already had plenty. We'll just do times one, that's fine for now. Glide versus spicy, sure, regular. Glide versus boost, yeah, let's have regular on that one too. Glide versus empty. Can you glide on nothing? I think Glide should be weak to empty, so I'm going to have it not do much to empty either. And I'm going to sort these ones out as I go. So, if Liquid is strong against Glide, I need to put that in. Wait, that's liquid against liquid. Where's Glide? Over here. And then that means that... What else we got here? Uh, glide v Virgin. Virgin v Glide. Doesn't matter. Um, thick times two. We've already done thick. Liquid versus Glide. Empty. Yeah, we'll get the empty. Chuck that empty in versus glide. Empty times two. Oops. It's times two on that one. It's buffering? Mm. What about everyone else? Is it buffering for you guys? Alright, well, I'll wait until... Uh, can anyone... Is anyone watching that can say that it isn't buffering? Normal for you? Alright, well... Don't think so, I see no buffer. Okay, well... I'm going to say that was on you guys. If you eat healthy, you glide better, so glide should be strong against salad. Wouldn't that mean salad is strong against glide? Wait. Yeah, no, you're right. Yeah, glide can be strong against salad. That makes sense. It's kind of like flying super effective against grass anyway, so... I don't mind that. Times two. Glide v glide. Uh, normal damage, I'm guessing. Glide against what? Being electrocuted in the air is not going to end well. I think it should do half damage. Glide is not looking too good. <laughs> glide is not looking too much like a good... good. Uh, the thing about flying is that it, it has this immunity to ground. But glide doesn't. Wait, hang on a second. I was going to make Glide weak to ground, actually. Uh, to Salad, sorry. Because I always landed on the grass. 
when I used Glide in my videos. I think that's what I'll do. But then again, then I'm wasting... Ugh. I feel like it should just be regular via liquid. And there's plenty of birds that fly in the rain just fine. Um... Hmm. I think it would be a good reference. I'm sorry, but I think it would be a good reference. But then, it's a very, very weak type. A ghoul could be times one. Fem could be times one. It could do double damage to Yummy, I guess. But Jesus Christ, a lot of things already do a lot of damage to Yummy. Well, this would be the fourth thing. Should be okay, I suppose. It's not like Yummy could, like, defend itself from someone gliding down to snatch it, like a seagull grabbing a, a cone. An ice cream cone, that is. Do we think there's maybe, like, something we could do to make this better? Maybe Glide could be immune to Urgh? The glide type could be high speed to make up for its lack of type advantage. Yeah, I suppose that could be the case. I also think maybe it could be... Maybe Urgh could do half damage to it. It could resist Urgh. Alright, uh, let me find her. So Urk does half damage to it. Man, Urk is not looking too good anymore. It needs to be good. It's not supposed to be bad. Maybe I'll just make it do times two damage to Urk instead. Hmm. You come back five hours later and you're actually making Pokemon Beige thing? Yeah. I think we'll just we'll just keep going for now and see see what see what we come up with. What do you what do you guys which type do you guys want to do next? Boost, okay. Well, we've got boost doing half damage to thick. We've got spicy. We can have boost super effective against spicy. We've got a lot of things that are weak to Spicy, I see here. Or just not doing much damage to Spicy. We haven't done Spicy Super Food against a couple things here. Okay, boost. Uh, what else? Uh, cold. Be half damage against Cold. I think we knew that already. Should we make it do half damage against Liquid too, seeing as it would, wouldn't would really be able to do much in Liquid? Especially since it's based on Sonic, for God's sake. I think, I think that makes sense, and I think that could be maybe it for its weaknesses. Oh right, it was supposed to be uh, effective against Empty. Because null space. You're fast enough to get out of null space. <laughs> That's so fucking stupid. Uh, let's see. One more super effective. Let's try... At least, at least one, I would say. Uh, okay, let's go 
times times one on virgin. Uh, times one on Urch. Uh, should we make it half on boost or regular on boost? Boost v boost. Nah, boost v boost would be interesting. Uh, salad. Vegetation. I guess a lot of vegetation would slow it down. But we could make it that it just... If we do salad, we could make it... Um, We can make salad resist. Wait, no, hang on. Yeah. Wait. Let's change that to that. Change ghoul to that. Change that to that. Change that to that. Boost sounds like the type of Pokemon man that would be weak to most types would be the best at support. Should boost be super effective against Ghoul or maybe Glide? Um, hmm. Ghoul or maybe Glide? It's already got a lot of weaknesses. A lot of resistances, I should say. It doesn't do much damage to liquid, cold, or thick. What I'm trying to think of is how would it fare against these things? Would it be able to attack these things very easily? I guess it wouldn't really be able to attack Glide very well. Tell you what. I'll make it I'll make it not do much damage to Glide. Glide's already got pretty shite um thing, so giving Glide a little bit of a boost will be pretty decent. But does that mean I need to give it another powerful thing? Will there be music in this game? Well, hopefully. I can't make music myself, though, so... <laughs> maybe I'll have to learn, or... Something. I don't know. Uh, boost can go with... Uh, shit. Um, what could Boost be good against? Maybe Ghoul? Maybe Ghoul? Sonic Fight Ghouls? That could work. Positivity beating the ghouls. Have fans submit music made from scratch? That'd be pretty cool. Thing is, though, if I was to sell the game, I wouldn't... You know, I'd, I'd want to pay us, but again, I wouldn't... I wouldn't. Music would be one of the very, very last things I would ever do. Depending on... But I would do. I might just get a thing commissioned or something. I don't know. Uh, there's what? There's ghoul. There's salad. Uh, okay, let's. Well, what are we doing next? Which which one do we do next, guys? Empty? Yeah, let's do empty. Yeah, I, I, th I think so. Fans making music for free could be prob problematic too, especially if we're gonna sell it. Because we're, we're just coming with ideas at the moment. This could all lead to absolutely nothing, and we could just absolutely throw ourselves under the bus and waste this entire night, and then 15 weeks in the future. Uh, empty. Okay. You know, we just won't call it Poker Man. From now on, this game's going to be called... Bejorino. Probably not. Probably shouldn't call that that. Uh, Alright, what are we doing? We're doing... Uh, uh, we just did boost. Okay. We're doing... Empty, was it? So, empty is... So, we can take a look down this empty aisle here. We see it does half... Glide does half damage to empty. Uh, what else we got? Boost does double damage to empty. Cold does 
half damage to empty. Why does cold do half damage to empty? Oh, because you can't freeze space because it's already cold. That's right. Virgin does zero damage to empty. And Yummy does times two damage to empty because it fills it up. So if we go starting from Yummy, it seems that empty would do half damage to food. What else was good against empty? Um, boost. So empty against boost. Wouldn't really work. Uh, what else was there? Um, cold. She can't freeze space. Oh, wait. This is me being super effective against cold. Okay. Okay. Seems good. Did I miss anything? Empty with glide. Glide over there. Empty with boost. Boost over there. Uh, cold did cold. Virgin and yummy. All right. So virgin, you do virgin. Times two in virgin. I think that looks good. Empty is going to be one of the more powerful ones. Um, empty does times one on Urch. It's times one on Liquid. You've got your... Uh, times one on Spicy. Empty v Empty. I would say that it does zero. It does just a zero damage, I think, personally. It doesn't affect empty. Vacuum wave on a vacuum wave doesn't really. Yeah, there's multiple zero. There's other things on there. That should work. Salad times one. Watt, just times one. Ghoul, times one. Femme, times one. Alright. Next up. Seems to be looking okay. There's a lot of resistances, I see, but I'm sure we'll be able to add a bunch more. <laughs> MTV, empty the game crashes. <laughs> Let's do spicy. It's Oh, liquid also down here is just... Anyway, uh, actually, maybe we'll do what? Times one on Virgin. Actually, if you electrocuted, hang on. I was gonna make these like some of these like, I wanted to make Virgin like the kind of like the dragon type. Virgin v Virgin is powerful. Ugh, v Virgin is powerful. Empty v Virgin is powerful. It resists Glide. What else should it resist? Is the question. It should resist Ghoul. Resist ghosts and things, because that's what resides in heaven and stuff. Ghouls, ghosts, goblins, demons. <laughs> I don't know. Uh, I think it should resist... Spicy, because it is made of hellfire, or angel fire. Doesn't need to breathe. Liquid ain't doing shit. Um, maybe electricity doesn't do much either. <laughs> I'm not sure. Let's just do that. This isn't Pokemon. This is a lie. I'm going to follow anyway. I'm making Pokemon beige. That's what's going on. Poco Man Beige. That's what's going on. And we're just working on some really boring stuff right now, but... 
Eventually we'll be getting into making the actual Pokemon after we finish off this fucking list. Alright, so I can do the times one here. Alright, what about Urgh here? Uh, regular against Ghoul, yeah sure. Salad, regular against Salad. Salad's regular against Ghoul, uh, Urgh, I mean sorry. Uh, liquid, regular against Urgh, yep. Uh, ghoul against Liquid. Okay, we need to start figuring these out. Salad, let's just do Salad next. Uh, liquid. I think it should be neutral, because Liquid can be anything, it's not just water. It can also be Magma, it could also be Mercury, it could be... Could be water. It could be... Well, actually, maybe I should make it weak to Liquid then. What else has Liquid had? Is Liquid looking any good? Got one thing super effective against it. A completely different note. I know you don't have the DLC, but do you see how the Crown Tundra breaks the main game of Sword and Shield because you can obtain level 70 Pokemon that obey you before the first gym leader? Wow! It's almost like they didn't think it through. And you got people, I, I actually saw that, I saw people defending it, saying, well, maybe it's it's, it's for the people who want to get an extra challenge and, and change the way they play the game next time they play the game. No, that's not the reason. They just messed up. They messed up. It's almost like it was cut content they're reselling. Yeah, well, it is. A lot, there's still a lot of cut content, which still isn't in the game. If you saw the alphas, pre-alphas of the game. Anyway, salad. Um, I feel like salad would be weak to cold. Anything to do with, like, you know, uh, something dying of the cold. Anything to do with spiciness, I guess it would kind of hurt the salad. Because that's hot. Anything to do with heat. Boost. I feel like it would... Did I make Boost get hit by... Uh, what was it? Salad? No. Times one. Empty. I feel like it would die in space. Salad v salad. Uh, that's not going to get you anywhere, but... Do that. Electricity. I feel like a dense forest will... <laughs> catch fucking fire. Uh... Glide on salad. Hmm. Glide does half against salad. So salad must do double against glide. That's what we're doing. I'm just mocking this up for now. Don't know if I'm actually going to do this. Uh, ghoul. A forest with ghouls. Hmm. If you chuck your food into the forest, we'll do more. <laughs> uh, let's think. Did you ever see Michael Myers eat a salad? <laughs> We're talking about ghouls here? Can ghouls affect salad? Um... Wait, can you have a spicy salad? Yeah, you can. But spicy in this one's more to do with, like, heat. Hotness. I'd say it's weak to it. Um... I think I might change salad to flora, or something along those lines, and I will change virgin to pure or clean or something. Uh, what am I gonna... I know glide is times two. Empty. Let's see, what has empty done for salad? Times one. Alright, empty's gonna be times one on salad then. Right, what about salad on salad action? It's times half. It's pretty easy. There's nothing super effective against salad? Spicy should be super effective against salad. Hang on. Uh, 
Wait, that's not right. It needs to be green. We're almost there, guys. Just figuring out these last ones are going to be the tough ones. Right, spicy and cold salad. You can have a cold salad, I suppose. Did, it, did we do cold before? What did cold work with salad? Times one. Jesus, I think everything's just going to be times one with fucking salad. What about spicy? Spicy did the half. Alright. What about boost with salad? It's times one. Alright. What about liquid with salad? Did we already do liquid? No, we haven't done liquid yet. Alright, we're gonna leave that for now. Uh, what? We haven't done what yet. We haven't done ghoul. We haven't done ghoul yet. Fem. We haven't done fem. Well, we did do fem. But it's times one. I suppose that makes sense. Wait, that's not right. There's a lot of things already attacking yummy. So we're not gonna make that attack anymore. We'll just do times one. I'm thinking we could make salad maybe beat Watts. What already is powerful against Urgh, which is one of the most powerful things in the game. Virgin salad. <laughs> I'd put hot sauce on a salad. <laughs> hot salad, that's so cursed. <laughs> Gotta get a hot salad. Alright, I'm gonna make it resist... Uh, ...what, and do super effective damage to what. It makes sense to me, at least. Because, like, if the lightning strike hits the forest, it just kind of... There's still more trees, right? Does this whole situation count as being social? I mean, kind of. A ghoul times one. Let's do liquid times one, sure. And neutralizes itself out. But that means that what will be half of salad. Jesus. So it's getting a lot of resistances here. And ghoul is times one, wasn't it? And liquid? What was liquid? Salad, just a regular. Salad's like the most boring type. Jesus Christ. It's just got... It's the same kind of thing as fem, but different. Which is good, I guess. Alright, let's see what else we got here. We got what? Liquid? V what? Well, thinking about it this way, if... Huh. Do most liquids conduct electricity? Do, does pure, like, mercury or something conduct electricity? Do... Okay, let's see. I know water doesn't conduct electricity unless it's got particles in it. Um, I'm thinking that what should not do much damage to liquid. But then it's got four things it's not doing much against. Hmm. Liquid iron could, yeah. Uh, what? I'll just do what v what right now. Electric v electric is just gonna short circuit shit. Wait, electric v electric could be times two? Would that make sense? Because, like, if you have too much electricity, it's gonna explode. This sounds pretty neat. Um, electric v ghoul? Times one. Man, ghoul is boring as fuck. <laughs> Literally, there's two things doing extra damage to ghoul, and ghoul resists nothing right now. Uh, I could have ghoul resist spicy, it just doesn't give a shit. That sounds about right. I'll have ghoul resist spicy. He just doesn't care.
uh, which means Ghoul up here does times two damage to Spice, I think. That's not right. There it is. Is this Rowan's theme? Do we have anyone generally good with science and common sense? Listen, man, if we had anyone good with general science and common sense, then our, our chart would look a lot different. And it would also probably be very unbalanced. Spooky Ghost eats Death Pepper? Spooky Ghost is fine. Yeah, right, because it's Death Pepper. And he's already dead. That makes sense. Right, let's continue with the Watts. Um, if you electrocute food, it generally turns it really bad. But the food has already got a lot of weaknesses. And I don't want to give it any more. Then again, food could be like a really weak type. I mean, ice has a lot of weaknesses. Look down here. Well, I mean, it's got a very a lot of com very common weaknesses. Um, but I need to be super effective against something. I could make it super effective against Glide. After all, Glide does half damage, so I guess I have to. So if you electrocuted while gliding, I think you will fall to the ground. Okay, what was it with empty? With what? It's times one. What about boost? Uh, what with boost times one? What with spicy? Haven't done that one yet. Yeah, I didn't do that one yet. What with liquid? Haven't done liquid either. Now's the time to think. Unless you do ghoul. We could do ghoul. What makes empty bright? That could make sense. But... It's space. A star is pretty bright. Doesn't make it... Doesn't make space any less, like... Absolutely dark. Liquid beats empty? How's liquid even doing here? How's liquid hanging? How's liquid going? Is liquid bad? Okay, times one, times one, times one, times one, times half, times two. It's looking pretty balanced right now. We could make it beat empty. Empty's got a lot of... Yeah, empty's doing a lot of damage to a lot of things. We could make liquid have a good going with empty. <laughs> liquid does two, two times damage to a salad because soggy salad is shit. Um, what did I put on Liquid with Sal? I just did it times one. Uh, but I could do Liquid versus Salad. I could make Liquid v Salad. I suppose I could. I have a think about it. We're gonna have to... Oh, Jesus Christ. Real Dean Mick. Subscribe to Tier 1. Thanks very much. It deserves to blow the whistle. <laughs> Good stuff. Uh, okay, for now we'll just try to figure out what the new stuff we've got. Because otherwise we're going to be here all day. We can sort out the extra stuff a little bit. What whistle is that? That's a siren whistle. Uh, let's see. Okay, so uh, ghoul. Let's do ghoul. Finish off. No, let's finish off what first. So it's got three super effective. It's got three resistances. I think that's fine. Let's just go times one for everything else. That makes the most sense for me. Uh, ghoul. Ghoul against Yummy. That's times one. No problems there. Um, ghoul against Femme. Ghoul, ghoul against Ghoul. Uh, should I have Ghoul resist Ghoul? Ghoul resists Spicy. Ghoul is weak to Virgin. Ghoul is weak to Boost. These are all the resistance. Maybe Ghoul could resist Empty, because it doesn't care. But then again, that's like doing a weird, like... Um... Would a soggy salad be classified as super cereal? <laughs> oh god. <laughs> I don't think it'd be classified as cereal. Uh, 
Uh... Oh, thank you, Real Dean MC. Thank you for your comment. Uh... Empty 0 0.5 times ugh, because it doesn't care. Well, I've already done it, ugh. We're a bit done. We're, we're done over there. We're just going to focus on these ones for the last thing. So, ghoul versus liquid. It can't drown. Just times one. Just, just... Ghoul's going to be real simple. Uh, doesn't care about the cold. Doesn't care if you boost at it. Oh, you know, boost is super effective against ghoul, isn't it? So, I'll make that a half. I think we just give it one more thing to be super effective against that Fem or Salad doesn't have, and we go from there. Let's see, so Fem, Salad, Salad's two times against Glide and Watt. Fem is these two, so there's Ghoul, and there's Empty. Ghoul wouldn't be super effective against, I, I guess Ghoul could be super effective against Ghoul. <laughs> ghoul v Ghoul. They're one of the only things that can hurt each other. That can, that can make sense. I can imagine that. Ghoul v Ghoul. Can't beat Empty because Purgatory. <laughs> oh, Jesus. Alright, I think that's good so far. And I think, judging from that, we can finish this. So, Spicy versus Liquid. We haven't finished Liquid. Okay, Liquid, liquid versus Liquid. Uh, half, I guess. Makes most sense to me. That makes a lot of sense to me. Uh, cold versus liquid was... Cold did double damage to liquid. So liquid should do, be doing half damage to cold. Already got three things that's not very good at. Liquid versus spicy. Alright, what, what did spicy say to liquid? Absolutely nothing. Okay, what about liquid versus boost? I think boost was weak to liquid. Okay, so liquid does times two damage to boost. That makes sense. Wait, that's not boost. There we go, boost is the next one. We looking good. It'd be fun if we added milk. Milk could beat spicy. <laughs> we could add a milk type for moves. Empty. Empty versus liquid. Uh, liquid, empty, where's empty? Empty, liquid. Liquid, liquid, liquid times one. All right. Let's see. Uh, liquid versus what? What versus liquid? Times one. What's this one? Ghoul. I think that's just times one. I think I'd remember that. Ghoul, liquid, times one, yep. Uh, Femme versus liquid. Yeah. And liquid times yummy. Times one. It's okay. We just need to figure out the spicy one. Um, okay, let's do spicy and figure out the rest. So spicy v spicy would be half. That would make sense. If you add more spice to spicy, it's just... Well, it's even more spicy, but... Well, you know. It's trying to combat each other's spiciness, but that doesn't work. Generally speaking. Uh, spicy v boost does half. I think I remember that. Correctly? I think I might change the boost to like hyper or something, I don't know. We'll we'll rename things as we go. <laughs> Spicy space, really? <laughs> Spicy is times one on empty. We're just making this simple. Spicy versus glide, glide versus spicy times one. Spicy versus what? What v spicy is times one. Uh, Fem versus Spicy is regular. 
Let's see, so if I were to balance this out, one, two, three, four, five, one, two, three. I guess I'd give it another super effective. Or maybe another times one. I think liquid and spicy could maybe just be... Yeah, I think it could just be times one. I think that'd be make things most simple. Right now, anyway. And that's our thing. It looks... There's a lot more times one in the Pokemon one. But... I think... I think we'll be okay. Right now, anyway. I wanted to have a couple of really basic ones. So that's like Femme, that's Ghoul, that's Salad. Um, there's... There's Virgin down here, which is pretty simple, but it's strong. Uh, Ugh is... Well, you know, thick resists a lot of things, but you know. Yeah, we'll have thick virgin types. We'll have a lot of different types. We'll have femme salads. We'll have boost colds, I'm sure. Sun Eye Speedy Cold. Like, for example, this little guy here. He could be like, for example, he could be like, uh, be a, uh, he could be a, is he'd be a what? He'd be a what, um, uh, what would he be? He'd be a what thick type. Maybe he'd be a what virgin, uh, what would he be? He's like a kind of watery, he's like a, I imagine him being like a salamander, kind of. So maybe he'd be like a, um, I don't know, maybe he'd just be a what type. Yeah, let's just make him a what type. That's fine, it'll work. He can be simple. He doesn't have to have a secondary typing. <laughs> Thick virgin. <laughs> Alright. If he was based on an otter, we could call him... Water. Get it? Water otter. Um, yeah. So I think that's pretty good. Uh, so we've got... All sorts of ideas there. We've got all sorts of... Uh, why did I point at the screen? You guys can't see me. And... Yeah. I think that's good. I, th I think we could... Change a couple of these names, to be honest. I think we should change... Boost to something. I think we should change Virgin to something. Um... Although I do like the way you guys are talking about, like, thick virgins. Uh, I like Fem. I like Ghoul. I like Watt. I like Glide. I want Salad to be changed. I like Empty. Or Null. We could call it Null? I think we could probably change Empty. Space, even, would work better. Uh, spicy, I like Cold. I like Liquid. I like Thick. Not 100% on Earth, to be honest. I like the idea, but I, I don't think it's like a... It's the only one that's a sound instead of... A, I, I'd like to get like that sort of disgusting sound you can get, but turn it into a word of some sort. And Yummy, I think Yummy could also do with a, a small change. Something else. Something so you know what it's about, you know. I keep saying Yumi, because I keep thinking of the League of Legends character. So everything apart from those, I, I do like... Um, oh yeah, somebody actually made, you guys talk about Sonic Forces for bloody Pete's sake. Yeah, somebody actually made a real chaos boss fight. It's simple, but it's amazing that they did it in the first place. You'd actually think it's supposed to be part of the game. It really is. Uh, okay. So, I think we should start with some starter Pokemon, eh? What do you guys think? Let's start down here. I'd like to make... Well, let's see. First of all, what what types are super effective against one another? So, Ghoul is weak to Virgin. Ghoul is strong against Ghoul. Ghoul is... <sighs> Jesus Christ. What am I going to do here? What types am I even going to do? Does it matter? Does it really matter what type you pick? I don't think it should. To be honest. Uh, I am thinking maybe... Ghoul? 
I'm thinking salad, and I'm thinking fem to start off the game with. I need to start with those here. Those are the most simple ones. They each have easy to remember like things. Weak against Urch and Thick. Strong against Fem and Yumi. Yummy. Ghoul is weak against Virgin and Boost. <laughs> Strong against Spicy and Ghoul. Uh, oh, those are both super effective against themselves. That makes sense. Okay. And the Salad is weak to Spicy and Salad. Wait, Salad is weak to Salad? No, Salad is... Wait, what? Doesn't do damage to Salad and Salad. It does extra damage to Glide and what? Okay. When I say weak to, I don't actually mean weak to. Alright. Okay. Alright. Let's start with my little boy. I'd like to make this thing a starter, to be honest. <laughs> I think it could be like turn into like this little plague doctor looking thing. I think it could it could be a real real cool looking idea. I think we'd have a fem one that goes into like this real like a beautiful woman, depending on what like secondary type we give her. And uh, the salad will be something to do with nature or something 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 cute. So mine is a ghoul, yes. So I could like. So I could like make make my wee dude. And he could like, doesn't have to look like my actual guy. Could look completely different. Like for example, he could be like a little lizard thing if I wanted. You know what I mean? This doesn't actually have to go along with like what my actual character design thing is. But I would like to give it like a little ponytail thing to be honest. Maybe like a little chicken. Maybe he can be like a little chicken, but he's like... You know. You know how these things go. I'll, I'll need to do this when I'm not so friggin' tired. No humanoid anthros? Uh, I don't think you were around when we were literally talking about, like, having just straight up Moemon as... as these Pokemon. <laughs> What is my hair even on this thing? Oh, it's very simple. It's just the one. And then it's just these. It's like a little chicken, kind of. I could make them like really, really simple. And then when you evolve them, they really do change. This is just this is just for basic ideas. <laughs> Look at this hair. It's kind of freaky looking actually. It's kind of looking too Yoshi like. Do I give it extra claws or do I give it like little hands here? It can still have its tail thing, but it's like a... <laughs> Honestly, I, I, I have no idea what I'm doing here. This isn't... I'm just, I'm just showing you like what sort of... This is how I start making things. Like usually I'll have a, a design idea or I'll look at like some pictures, but right now I'm just like kind of going from my memory, which is not going to end up well. And then the final one can be like some sort of, I don't know, uh, what would its secondary typing even be? Would I add a secondary typing? If I would add a second one, it'd be ghoul. Ghoul and maybe glide? That'd make sense, right? I'd like that. It's like if I were to make a... I, 
stage. <laughs> I don't know what I'm doing here, but... <laughs> what am I doing? What am I doing? It's like a cape, but it's used for gliding. And then it's got like these long, flowing, these long flowing locks. There you go. There's like just an idea of maybe one direction that could go in. A very, very simple, very like simple idea. Those aren't boobies, those are, it's hands. He's got a little, he goes, ma. He's me, me. But he'd have like extra designs and stuff. It wouldn't just be that bloody simple, so. <laughs> Look, I don't know what I'm doing here, but um, you get my you get my basic idea. You get my gist. Maybe it's like a cape. Maybe it goes around him like a cape. I don't know. Maybe he shoots like maybe he's like this little like. He shoots like ash from his mouth or something. He goes, Puh! Can we get a Pokemon that's a bush with legs? You mean Tangela? Isn't Tangela a bush with legs? It's more like a vines with legs. I aim to get it back like to that simple time of Pokemon. Do they look like Pokemon? See, he's just got like a really long, nice, lovely, like, cape, which he can use for gliding. And you see him flying across the sky. Like this. With his legs tucked in. That's kind of gross looking, but... You see a silhouette across the sky. Gliding along. He needs to look kind of sad. No, he doesn't look happy. Uh, and then he's got his little thing in it, like... And, like, has a little streamer behind him. Boom, there you go. And that's, like, that's that's one idea. Boom, done, right there. Not that that's finalized or anything, but, like... I like that idea. Although, if he's gonna be a ghoul... Hang on. Ghoul... Slash... Glide... If he's if he's ghoul slash glide type, then what will his weaknesses be? Hang on. Oh god, I'm gonna have to. Work. I have to like remember everything. Like you tell me if he's a, like a fire fighting type. I can think of all these things on the fly, but I have to rethink about every single thing on here. So ghoul is does half damage against virgin. No, I'm not looking for what it does. I'm looking for what it's weak to. So defending ghoul. Here we are. Where, where we are ghoul. So uh, it does. Damage, so it's weak to Ghoul, it's weak to Boost, and weak to Virgin, and it's strong against Spicy. Yeah, uh, so it's weak to uh, a Ghoul, Boost, and Virgin. Uh, uh, so, uh, Ghoul, Boost, Virgin, times two, uh, uh, Spicy times half and then what's the other one uh, gliding gliders <laughs> weak to what salad empty and liquid and yummy so what salad empty yummy this is sounding like the worst Pokemon ever it's already weak to one, two, three, four, five, six, seven things. What does it resist? Come on, what does it resist? A boost and thick. As you can see, it, it it's weak to one, two, three, four, five, six, seven 
weak to seven things and resists it's three so this is what i mean by we're gonna need to redo this <laughs> like i i i don't i i i i i i don't i don't know What is this? Sock Puppet Kermit? Uh... Will it levitate? I don't know. Well, that's what- that's it gliding right there. Wait, I forgot it's little, like, cape thing. There we go, that's better. This will be the mascot, without a doubt. Fly Kermit, fly. Can we make lore for it? Chibi Lugia. Final evolution of Trico. Uh, final evolution would get destroyed by Virgin. Uh, for it is born, it, it assumes the form of a purple egg. The egg is very tasty. <laughs> um. Uh. It's not balanced. It sounds like time of dark all the Pokemon would make. Caveman is weak to boost. And also resists boost. Would it not be neutral to boost? Is it weak to boost? Oh, yeah, right. It is. It's neutral to boost. So, 6 and 2. Not that much better. So, it needs to... Needs to... I think empty, maybe. We should shove off and give it another resistance somewhere. I think Ghoul needs another resistance, to be honest. Ghoul doesn't have many resistances at all. I think you guys agree with me on that one. Uh, Ghoul should resist something else, because it only resists one thing right now, and every other one of the starters have resisted two things. I think. Hang on, let me check. Salad resists... Salad resists three! And Fem resists... Only one? Wait, what? Oh, because it is times two to itself. And it resists... Okay, but it's only weak to two things, is the thing. Whereas Ghoul is weak to one, two, three things. It only resists one. So I think we should give Ghoul a resistance to maybe... What's something strong that kind of needs something to be resisted to it? Um, Virgin? Ghoul is weak to Virgin. Why is Sal only weak to one thing? Spicy. Needs to be weak to something else too. Sal should also be weak to like, ugh. We're gonna have to redo this later on, but right now we're gonna focus more on the, um, the designs rather than the thing. I actually really like this. <laughs> really like this design. I think it's, it flows quite well. You've got, you've got the little cute boy at the bottom. You've got the, the edgy teenager and you've got the majestic adult who, Spoots Ash. He's Spooda. He spoots Ash. He goes, Puh. He does a little cough. And the cough is because he's based on a plague doctor. And they wore those things for the plague. And the plague would make you cough, I guess. There you go. Nice. Do I take design recommendations? I mean, you can always offer your, um... Ideas. Don't mind that at all. That's pretty clever. Thank you. Thank you. What if we had, like... I'm not sure how you'd start off a Fem Pokemon. Let, let's, let's try... Uh, I guess we'll save this for now. And I guess we'll go tomorrow... Maybe tomorrow night or something. Gonna see if my stuff arrives tomorrow so I can start filming. But um, for now, I, I'm quite happy with the work we've got done so far. We've got a lot of references. We've got two whole Pokemon started. We've got a little little Lemming man, and we got our we got our um, Plague Doctor starter. Looks kind of like a grass type, but he's gonna have like a black cape. And he's going to be, probably be grey. 
Um, probably give more detail later on, but I think I think the simpler the better, to be honest. So we can give our own concept Pokemans. I mean, if, if you have a, a good idea for either a reference for one of these or something, you can always offer your off your ideas. Um, <coughs> but generally speaking, this is going to be um, my vision, my baby, my one and only. I've been wanting to do this for so long. Like, but if you have any ideas that I really, really like, uh, I will, of course, with your permission, add them in. But if I don't like it 100%, it's out the window. It's gone out the window. But save them. Save save them for next time. Will I post the chart and stuff s somewhere? Um, well, I don't really have a place to do it. If you if you want the chart, if you want to see if you could maybe make it better, here you go. <laughs> uh, if you want to maybe fix it hang on there if you want to take a screenshot of that and maybe try and make it better the ones on the left are where they attack from the ones coming down is defending same with like on here on the pokemon one you can see it there if you ever want to just take a screenshot and try and fix it maybe make it make more sense i love for it to be balanced but obviously right now it's not balanced in the slightest so we'll just have to very slowly one day make our way through it try to fix it Probably the way to fix it is to make a lot more things times one. And a lot less things uh, be super effective against one another. I think I've just added way too many, like, super effectives and negatives and all that shite. <sighs> anyway, thank you all for watching. I've got actually a very sore throat because I've been talking all day. Um, and I should have been letting it rest, to be honest. But I was really excited to get back to streaming, so... Thank you all for joining. Um, yeah, it was a lot of fun. Thank you, thank you very much. I'm surprised I had even 40 viewers on this. Uh, next time, I think we'll focus more on drawing these boys. I think I'll make maybe I'll make one of the starters based on Poppy and make that the fem type. And maybe I'll make one based on... If the other one's going to be salad, it's... Maybe I'll make one based on Big Rose. Who knows? I don't know. Anyway, thank you all. Okay. Or maybe I'll make it a yummy Pokemon. To start off with. And it can be based on like an ice cream or a bagel or something. Fun's just beginning. How many do I plan to make in total? As many as I can. But um, I'm aiming for maybe like 150. I think that's the minimum you can really make to have a good Pokemon-style game. You need a lot, I think, at least in my opinion. Okay. Bye-bye. Catch us later. Ugh.